Oh God, I finally found it. After 10 minutes of rocket around in a circle. Okay, I'm here. Zosa, you're here! You're awesome! Woo! There by you the way, go. By the way, Zosa, 3.0 3 is out on the PTU, so we can go get lost on the planet together, and you can crash, and I can still enjoy it. Hmm. Okay, now that we're all here, I'd like to get started because I actually like plan something for the session. Oh damn! By the way, I no. got my fan club with me, so yeah, right we can go. we can hear them. Alrighty, we are all here. We left off last session with not a whole lot spectacularly going on because I didn't plan anything. Um, Earl was really entertaining. He's still alive. Uh, so Zeus, you're probably going to want to burn your, your cloak at some point, because he was up on your shoulders. Actually did. Um, so, yeah. So, uh, you guys were traveling up the coast last we left you. Okay, Zeus, are you paying attention? As much as I can. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay. I'm listening. You got my I need attention. you to pay attention because you got the highest roll, so this is all on you. So, the first sensation you become aware of is, is the, the back and forth motion. Your eyes are closed, and you just you feel like your head's spinning. Like the one time Magda convinced you to drink way more than you should have. What she did. No, um, like the one time, like in the past. So right now, your your eyes are closed. It's your head's kind of spinning, and then you realize, no, my head's not spinning. The whole my everything's spinning. No, it's it's not it's not spinning. It's it's like a back and forth motion. You're you're you're, you're feeling stiff and, and groggy, and you open your eyes, and you don't recognize your surroundings. Mm hmm You you get up. And you realize your armor's gone. You don't have anything on you. You're, you're, you, there's wood below you. And you realize, no, you're not spinning. You're fine. You're a little sore. It's the wood beneath you and around you is spinning. Not spinning, sorry, going back and forth. You look over to your side and you see metal bars and you realize you're in a cage. Okay. The years you've traveled with Magda, you, you start to realize kind of what's happening here, and you realize you are on a ship. Zoza, you're fine. Everyone's lost right now. That's kind of the point. No, no, don't. Ignore me. I'm talking to Yolo. Fine. It's I fine if most of you have black on your screen. Um, Zeus, I need you to zoom way out, because your character should be way at the bottom. Can you see One your second. character? Yeah, I, I, hold on, let me get the kid's feet out, though, off, out of the screen. Hold on. If you guys want to see what's going on, um, pop over to my Twitch channel, so you'll be able Ooh, to I see, see it. Oh, I see. Ooh, this is awesome! Okay. So you realize you're on a ship. Woo! And you hear across from you, like, angry, like, muttering and sputtering and nasty, stupid, to kill them all! Is that you Earl? Recognize, you recognize Earl. He's in a separate cage across from you. What would you like to do? Your Twitch, your Twitch channel is offline. Well, I guess I would try to... Well, since Earl is my friend, I've seen the only friend you got. I see, is he okay first? Hey, Earl, are you okay over there? Sorry, hold on. I want to check Twitch. Um, because I am apparently streaming on the wrong. No, I'm on June Calf, not Jin Danny. There, Hulk. I'll link it to you. I think he's on the wrong channel. It's in um, Roll20. Man in Twitch. Okay. Um, 
So Earl kind of kind of notices you, and he looks over your shoulder. <clears throat> He's... Fuck, I can't get his voice right today. Uh, walking Boots is awake, yes, friend. He's awake, awake. Finally, finally, he's awake. And he, he walks over to the bars, and he's leaning through. Don't know where we are. Don't know what happened. Woke up here, strange. It's good to hear. Yeah, I'm up, my friend. Gotta get out, gotta get out. Don't know where they are, so nasty. Dwarfs walking around, hate them. Get out, get out. Walking boots, you strong, you muscle. Can see the muscle rippling on your chest. Very nice. That's how you found out Earl was bisexual. So you're you're stuck in, in this cage. You know, and then you've got these, these bars in front of you. You kind of go up to them and kind of, kind of test them and feel them out. Um, you want to try and, and pry them open like you did with uh, Magda's cells? Hmm. How far is Earl from me? Um, he is... His cell is 15 feet away from yours. He's on the other side. Is he in a cone-like distance from me? Yes. If you want to try your lightning breath, you could tell him to move. You know, I want to try lightning breath. I didn't want to fry Earl. Lightning breath. I figured the heat would blow the bars open. So I like to try that. Can I do that? Um, you, you could. The thing is, your lightning breath, it's, it's electricity, so it'd probably get into the, the metal and probably... Wait, no, does lightning breath, like, push people back? Yeah. I was hoping it would melt the metal. It's electricity, it's not gonna melt it. If you had fire breath, you could try that. I think it's more of a stun attack. Nah, oh, man! It's like a cone so that cool. does lightning damage. <laughs> so, it's it's not gonna do much to the bars. It would probably yeah. just fry Earl. Mm. Go ahead, go ahead and knock it out. <laughs> I don't know. No, no, uh, you don't know until mm. you try, right? If you're not yeah, here, I shush. Would do it. I would do it. <laughs> I'm trying to do that. Shush. But, no, if... I better not. Let's see. What would be a great way to get out? I guess I'll try to pry it open since I have. Um, I'm pretty strong. All right. So roll me a strength check. I don't think smell has anything to do with bending bars. Do you remember how to do that, Zeus? That's right. Yeah, that's the right one. Yes, it is. So after some some heaving and, and having. You actually manage to lift the one of the the bars out of its hinges, and you toss it aside. So you you had your way with this this cage, and you're able to step out, and you can now move your icon freely. It was it was pretty noisy, and you hear from the other end of the ship. Hey, okay. what's Earl. that? What's going on? What was that noise? Uh, that was me breaking the bar, Earl. You okay, Earl? That Earl, was an get Earl. You out of here. <laughs> Got their attention, you did! Think one's coming down! Okay, yeah, let's get out of here, though. Come on, uh, is he in the- Can I get brick his bars, too? Yeah, you can do another strength. Strength struck. Um, no, so that one failed, um... And unfortunately, another dwarf has come along and he, see, he sees you... ...trying to break out, and you swing around and you just see this this dwarf. Hey, what the hell are you doing? All these grumpy voices are gonna ruin me. I'm trying to get my friend out of here. No, the prisoners are escaping! Help! Help! Hmm, right now I would probably think of... He, I need to silence him before he gets away. Um, did you want to try and knock him out? I want to do lightning breath. Alright. Yeah, you hit him. I, and I use lightning breath because it's supposed to stun him, right, as well? Well, um... You only did three damage to him. That's not enough to, to stun him. He, he's kind of surprised because he just got electrocuted, but he's still standing. And he, he's, he's hollering. He's still hollering. Uh, you, you might end up having to fight this guy. What would you like to do? 
you've got high charisma. You could try talking to him as well. You could try like knock him, knocking him out. What do you want to do this? So, uh, what can I do? Um, is he knocked out? Oh, he, he's not. You can try knocking him out, which would be another strength check. You've got high charisma, so you could try talking to him, or you could just fight him. I don't want, eh, I try not to use violence if necessary. So, I talk to him with high charisma. charisma. Alright, uh, roll me a charisma. Or a persuasion. Alright, so, say what you want to say to him. Zeus? I'm listening. Okay, so you can, you rolled your persuasion, like, talk to this guy. What are you going to say to him? I've, I'm sorry for bringing home to you, but I we just want to get out of here. Me and my friend, we don't want to hurt you, dude. Honestly. Uh, so this, this poor dwarf Does... kind of looks up at you, and he's just been electrocuted. Who? The dwarf or... The dwarf um, guy. he's a pretty robust fellow. Oh, yeah. Um, Sound like he mostly... Can I give him money? You already succeeded on the persuasion check, so you, you're you okay. You don't need to bribe him. Um, he kind of just looks up at you and realizes that okay. he's kind of intimidated by you, and he's like, okay, so this massive dragonborn is not about to mess me up, and I don't know what's taking my buddy so long. I'm on my own. So he's kind of just like, all right, all right, man. Um, I'm just going to pretend like I didn't see you. There's, like, I don't, like, shit, you know, it's haunted, and that's what I'm going to tell them, and I'm just going to walk away now. And he leaves you in a roll, me. Um, so, yeah, now it's just, again, you and Earl. Um, did you want to try and break him out again? Or are you going to leave him there for now, maybe come back if you find a key? So I can get Earl out now and take him with me now, or just leave him? Um, you can try and get him out. It'd be another strength check. Yeah. If that doesn't... Okay, roll your strength. Keep a man behind. Oh my god, I don't know what it is, Earl, today. Yes, stupid lizard! What good are you? Ah! I'm sorry, um, I'm sorry, buddy. He actually starts waving his arms around. Uh... Can I convince the... The elf to, uh, the elf to help me let him out. Hold on, he's waving his arms around, which the rest of the party know is not a good thing. Oh, great. It's an excellent thing. <laughs> He'll grow a third arm or some crap. Spontaneous fireball! Spontaneous combustion would be nice. That'd be real nice. This is going to be how Magda and Kra bond. Oh my god, this Are is amazing. Okay, so Earl waved his hands, right? Um, suddenly you hear dwarves running. And you look over where this storm lantern is, it's kind of above you on the map, and you see two dwarves come into sight, and the other guy who you just talked to comes running back around as well, and these dwarves, they link hands and they start singing and dancing in a circle. Oh no. And okay. you're really confused as to what just happened. Hmm. Um, uh, so, so do you want- I will let you try another strength save? Yeah, that's- I'm kind of like, uh, what is going on here? Ah! Don't know, don't know, don't know, never know what's gonna happen. We gotta get back to our friends. So, roll me another strength. No, it's not. This thing is not moving. Um, you don't know what the hell happened. Maybe you were just in like bad craft craftsmanship with your cage, but um, you kind of have to give up at this point. Like this, this Earl's cage is not budging. That stupid lizard! Stupid lizard! Go find a key. 
So he's kind of waving you away now because he, he wants you to, to find a key to get him out. At this point, he's like, no, you're useless. Go away. Um, so unfortunately, Zeus, you're going to have to give up on helping Earl for now. Uh, what would you like to do? Okay, I guess I can go try to find a key. All right, so y you make your way down this hold. Uh, what the hell did I just do to your token? Um, you go past the dwarfs that are all like off to work. We go and chanting and crap. You're not sure what's going on there. Um, and you find some some stairs. Are you just gonna head up these stairs, or do you want to do it a bit more stealthy? What do you want to do? Zeus. Sorry, I'm talking to my niece. Yeah. What did you say now? Okay, so you find some stairs heading up to the next deck. Do you want to go up a bit, st like, stealthy, or are you just going to walk up and hope mm. no one's there? I, I know I'm pretty strong. I could just charge in, but I won't decide. So just be stealthy as I can. Yeah, just okay, be stealthy. Um, roll me a stealth roll. Wait, how did I get a 16 still? I have zero. Wow! Don't, yeah. don't, don't complain. So, um, I'm gonna say because you don't have your gear on, you, you manage to be a little bit quieter than usual. So you make your way up these stairs. Awesome. All up right. Onto... I gotta find a key for Earl. I get, we gotta get out of here. Can I even see? Is this place dark? Hold on, I gotta put yourself on. Okay, you should be able to see yourself now. Okay. Um, just out of character here, uh, Zo Zoza and Hulk, if you guys could scroll down to the bottom of the map that you're on now. Yeah, I can see myself. Okay. So, you come up this set of stairs, and you're not seeing anyone around. Um, do you want to go to the north end of the the boat or to the south end of the boat? Is there like a wall here? Am I in a cell or what? Yeah, you guys are in the cells, so quit complaining. Is that the door right there? Zeus? Mm -hmm. Uh, where do you want to go? Do you want to look at the north end of the map or the south end of the map? I want to... Always go forward, so I want to go north. Okay, hold on. Zozo, where are you? What? Where are you? Are you in a cell? Yeah, I am. Why? I don't know. I don't think I'm awake yet. <laughs> hey, Zach. Oh. Yes. Um, team speak. Okay, one second. Oh, yes. So you can? Yes. Okay, um... 6,815 left your channel. Thekilo was moved out of your channel. Bags are sneaking away. YOLO, if you woke okay, up Okay, so how did we get on a boat? Like, did this happen last time? Because I don't remember that. No. And I'm kind of wondering how many hit points I have, because I'd hate to be banging on the bars and knock myself unconscious, because I don't have any hit points. Oh, yeah. Yeah, be careful. If we slept through this, I think you got full rest. <laughs> <laughs> right? Like, damn. Yeah. How did we get here? Nice to start out the mission with a map, though. This boat's pretty legit. 6,815 joined your channel. Thekilo Sorry, I had to, to give channel. Thek some info. Um, Zeus, you start, like, stealthily mo moving north, um, hoping to find your gear and... and a key. 
um, as you're making your way stealthily around some boxes, you hear noises. And and you you hear a cry of pain. Uh, roll perception for me to see if you recognize the voice. I'll give it to you. You recognize the cry as Magda. Um, what? You That's decide. My Where is she? Where? Wait. She's Magda, the voice is. Hello? It's coming from the direction. Oh God. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, there we go. Awesome. Start so now everyone knows where you are. Um, you hear a voice. Some guys like, wait, what? What the hell's coming? What's that? Oh my god! Missing prisoner! Or escaped prisoner! Um, and you hear some thudding coming from the other end of the map. And you now have two guys who are not looking happy right now. Um, you, yeah. Um, do I have to fight them? Like, knock them out and be on my way? Um, as you're looking at these guys, you're thinking you might have to fight them. Uh, two, two more. Come out, come out some doors, because you cried out. Then there goes yourself. So um, it's now 1v4. I need you to roll initiative for me. Are any of the rest of us awake? You're in cells. Um, I know. I'm just asking. What am, I, am I missing it? Missing what? Initiative. Perception. Wait. Wait. Initiative is at the top of your character sheet above your hit points. There. Oh, I was on the wrong token. Did I do it right? You definitely did it perfectly, Zeus. My initiative is wrong? No, it's fine. You're on the board. I did it for you. Yay! Um, Unfortunately, you don't have a broadsword, so you don't have your gear on you. Um, so, one of these guys gets to attack you first. I need to find the right thing here. Who goes first, the monster? Yeah, um, this dwarf, he's, he's swinging an axe at you. And unfortunately hits you for... Nine damage. Did we get a full rest, June? Um, you guys and you and Anvil did. What about me? Did I have full rest? Yeah, you're you're at sixty hit points. Um, so now it's your turn, Hulk or Zeus. You can go. Okay, I want to use broadsword. You don't have your broadsword. You have no gear. You're not, you don't even technically have your armor on right now. So basically I have to use more of magic cool things. Okay, first then I guess we do, um, can I cast, uh, lightning breath and divine smite at the same time? Just cast one or the other. Uh, divine smite would not work with your lightning breath. Hmm. Like, you can still use your Lightning Breath, you just can't use Divine Smite with it. Okay, I'd use Lightning Breath then. Alright, um... Roll. So, it hits two of them. Great damage each. Sorry, I'm just doing some adjustments here. Um, the two of them are stunned. Which means one guy's gonna miss his turn, and the other guy didn't hit. Just rolled a nat twenty. I'm sorry, Zeus. Uh, no problem. So he hits you for twelve damage. Unfortunately, is the crit. Um, the other guy is stunned, so he's gonna miss his turn, which means it is now your turn, Zeus, again. Okay, I would like to do... Divine Smite this time. You need a melee weapon. Which I guess could count as your fists. I thought Divine Smite was, um... Um... Magic. No, uh, well it is, but, um... When you hit a, a creature with a melee weapon attack... 
Okay. I guess I guess I'll go ahead and do lightning breath then. All right, uh roll. No, you only need to use it once. Um Actually, I guess you could use it twice. You have two attacks. Uh Uh, okay, so they all failed their saves. And the other guy takes... Alright, so two of these guys are hurting, and you used your attack twice, so I'm gonna say they're all stunned, which means it's your turn again. So you can you can do another lightning breath, dude. Like two of these guys are hurting. Zeus. Hmm? Roll Sorry. lightning breath. It's your turn. Again? Awesome. Yeah, everyone else is stunned. Uh roll it again. Okay, so the one does not hit. The other one does. So um, two of these guys collapse to the ground. They're out of it. Um, the other guy you didn't hit, so it's his turn. Uh, he he completely missed you. You dodge it out of the way like a badass motherfucker. Um, which means it's your turn again. Zeus. Okay, I don't know where I went. So that guy's stunned. Another lightning breath. Wow, Jesus. Uh, so the guy's not stunned anymore. Shocked him out of his stun. <laughs> yeah, apparently. Um... If I wanted to be a total asshole, I'd say he restarted one of the guys' hearts, and he now has to fight two of them now. <laughs> um, I won't do that. He doesn't have his gear. Is that missed? Okay, stunned again. And he's dead. Okay, good job, Zeus, for killing all of them. Gonna write down the XP because I know Zeus won't. Zeus. What's up? Sorry about that. All right. Uh, I finished the fight. Congratulations! You kicked your, their asses and you got 300 XP. Awesome. Uh, so yeah, those guys are gone. You still don't have your gear. You hear another cry of pain from Magda coming from the north of the ship. You make your way through the door. Some of the dwarfs came through. Initially, you don't see anything, but you're now in a brightly lit room at the front of the ship. You go around a corner, and you are met with the sight of Magda. No gear on, like you, but I'll let her keep her dignity, and she's still got her skeevies on. And she's strung up. Her arms are above her, tied up, and they've got her tied to the roof, and a couple of the doors are, are taking turns, like, doing, like, kidney shots. They're using her as a punching bag. Shut up, Zoza. Um, what would you like to do, Zeus? Magda, you are now here, so you can interact as well. Okay. Right now, she's focused on being punched a whole lot and trying to kick them whenever they try to get near her, but I know that's going to be pretty futile. So you're probably just cussing up a storm at these guys. Oh, yeah, I definitely am. <laughs> All right, Zeus. What'd you say? I heard you. It's my turn again. Yeah, you're not in combat. You just, you see Magda being beaten up by these guys. What would you like to do? Hmm. Do I see, see I see her? Yeah, you see her. You see me being tortured. By a bunch of dudes. 
Uh, you could just sit and watch. <laughs> right? I'm trying to let's see. Um, yeah. I'm coming to save my friend. So who's oh, in the way? Shut up. Like wait, wait, I'm no, I'm not. <laughs> Cause last time then I hit my friend. Yeah, because I'm I would be right in the middle of it. Because I can't move okay. strung up to the ceiling. I, I'm stuck where I am. Okay, so you come around the corner. And and you see you see this happening. Magda, after taking a, a kick at one of these guys, the ropes swing around and she sees you. Unfortunately, everyone else sees you too. Uh, so one guy in, in heavier armor, he, he sees you and it's like, wait, what is this? What do we have here? Well, 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 if it isn't your pet lizard. Wait till I get out of this. I want to fucking murder all of you. <laughs> Good luck with that one, Magda. Ain't gonna happen. How about we just skin your lizard in front of you, get some nice boots out of him. Good luck with that. He's stronger than he looks. Uh. Uh, uh, fuck. Zeus, can you roll a perception check for me? Okay. Okay, um, you don't notice what I want you to notice. Anyway, um, these guys now kind of start to swarm you a bit, um, and the, the dude in heavy-duty armor is still just kind of hanging around by Magda. Uh, so you, unfortunately, are going back into combat, bud. Uh, Magda, I want you also to roll initiative. Okay. Even though I'm strong to the ceiling. Yeah, but the guy standing right next to you and is probably not paying attention to you. So I'm just saying. Okay. Also, you're like OP strong, so if you want to try and like break those ropes. I was also thinking of killing him Mortal Kombat movie style where she... Where Sonya fucking him strangles him with your like thighs. With my thighs. <laughs> you could try that too. <laughs> Hell yeah. Because being thrown to the ceiling means I'm higher than normal. <laughs> All right. Um. I'm just gonna get this back on the board. So, the, the dude in heavy-duty armor, um, Magda, I'm just gonna tell you, you know who this guy is, uh... I know who all these fuckers are. Yeah, um, the dude in the heavy-duty armor is... what the fuck did I name him? I didn't- I didn't name him anything, I named the other guy, shit. Um, I need a dwarf name, someone help me out here. Um, Thectilo. Draven? Uh, I don't know. Ruffle Fuck it, Draven. Dwarf. Works. Okay. <laughs> um, you know, this guy is Dra Draven Goldfist, and he is the cousin of uh, King Turd of Turd Mountain, that is the leader of this clan. So he's, like, he's fucking, like, probably number three on your want to murder list. Sweet. And he's, he's right there. So that's the info on him. And he okay. would have been there when your family was killed. So it's your turn first, so uh, I will let you do what you want to do. Can I strangle him with my thunder thighs? <laughs> uh, I want you to roll a strength check. Did I push the strength button? I always forget how that works. Yeah. Um, so you managed to like, get your legs around him, and he's like, what the flying fuck is happening? Um, you're not really doing any damage right now, but it's enough that he can't really, like, escape right away. Ha! Gotcha. Um, so this dude... Probably because of all that armor. So I'm trying to strangle him right now, at the very least. Either way, he's mine. Damn, with these fucking nat 20s. Um, I'm sorry, Zeus, you just took another 12 damage. 
Roger that. Don't worry, the other guy missed you. It's now your turn. What do you want to do? Let me make sure I take 12 points off. Uh, let's see. I did it. 58. 48. Hey, hey June. What? Okay. What is my positioning? Okay, they round me. I can shoot all them guys. Alright, where's that Tello? Is she on the map? Are, are Hulk and I yes. awake? You two are awake, so if you two want to like PM each other and try and make plans, you can. Well, can I want to shoot Latin Breath at the three guys oh. to um, the right. You would have heard, oh my god, Bagda, are you okay? And so you're like, uh, what the fuck's happening? Okay. Combat's just started, so as combat gets going, you guys will start to hear that happening. I just want to bust the bars and get out of here. Um, in two turns, I will let you roll a strength check. Same. Okay. Okay, I would like to, if I can, I think it'll miss Magna, though. Um, I would like to see the three guys in front of me. I would like to do Magna Breath. I hope they get me. You're going to hit Magna. You're going to hit Magna. Darn it. Mm. Um, if you aim to try and hit two of them and not three of them, I will, that would miss Magna. If you don't want to hit three, you just hit two. I'm trying to focus on the second guy in the middle of the cone. And then aim at the guy on your left. Like who's right above you? Yeah. We so got a, okay, so you can use lightning breath on those guys. So go ahead and roll. You won't okay. hit Magda. Yeah, that hits. Um, and again, like the, you do have two attacks. So if you want to use lightning breath twice, you can. So you can roll again. Um. Okay. All right. So you hit these guys for. Not math. It's public math, so it's even harder. I know, right? Oh shit, son. Um, so these these two guys go down immediately. Two of them are, are done. You're now, you have two guys left to deal with, and Magda's doing her thing with the one guy. Um. I'm actually gonna have this guy roll a strength check. Yeah, no, you've got fucking ties of steel, lady. He's not getting out. Ha! Uh, the other guy. That's a swing and a miss. So he does not hit you, Zeus. Um, Meg, it's your turn. Did you want to try and do another strength check on this guy's neck? Yep. All right. He's starting to turn blue, but he's not down yet. Okay. Uh, so this guy hits you, Zeus, and he hits you for... Where did it go? I think it's 9 damage. Let me double check that. It is. It's 9 damage. Um, it is now your turn, Zeus. What you can do, what I would suggest... Are you listening? Mm-hmm. Okay, I'm going to move your character up one point, and then roll... <laughs> Dragon Breath twice, one on the guy directly to your right, and then the guy to your bottom, and you won't hit Magda at all. Roger that. Great. Should be much less DM interference. Just let him hit Magda. You know what? Some people are new, and they need help. So shut your mouth. You can deal with the dwarf later. It's way fun to watch him flail his freaking buddy. <laughs> Some people need help. Shut your mouth. You That's also weird. he also doesn't have any gear. He's a dragon. And he's doing just fine with his lightning breath. As long as he doesn't hit Magda. Who may or may not be at half health. Okay, so these guys are still both standing. Uh okay, this guy's doing it. Do another strength check. And he's gonna do disadvantage. Magdex, he's already turning blue. He's lightly tapping at your leg, because he rolled a fucking crit fail. <laughs> so I'm not even going to roll again. He's tapping at my leg like he obviously wants me to let him Like, go. tap out here. Um, <laughs> so it's your turn, Magda. Crushing that freaking windpipe. Roll. Oh, nice! Snap that neck! 
So you manage to get him close enough with like the rope that you have enough leverage and you just like fucking crack. And it's it's satisfying and it's instant and he goes limp and falls to the ground. Ha! What's that pricked on? I think that was 500 XP just for him. Yay. Crikey. That's why you don't fail your strength rolls, kids. <laughs> yep. Um, that guy. Oh, he's stunned anyway. He doesn't get a turn. Zeus, it's your turn. Okay, um, let me see. I see Magna is nowhere around. Can we do the same thing we did last time? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, right, yeah. Um, sorry, Zeus, keep rolling. Uh, Anvil and Zosa, you guys can do your strength checks. Yeah, mine's, I rolled mine. Abysmal. Um, a quick, quick interlude between the combat. Um, so, so the monk tries to to pry his bar open, and like does nothing. You're just like turning red in the face and like huffing and puffing. Hey, he's popping out of his neck. Yeah, no, he's he's huffing and puffing, and Anvil can hear this. Like he's stuck his head out, and he can he can kind of see Zosa's hands like failing, and then you're just you're laughing. You're laughing at this sad little little attempt. Did I get out? You did. At, like once you're done laughing, you you manage to to break your way out of these bars. Where is Zosa? Up or down? North or south? You're at the bottom. You don't see him. You would have. They would have been north. You would have seen these hands sticking out of a bar north of you. Left or right side? Okay. There you go. All right. Now can I try to break his bars? Yeah. Roll. Yeah, it's a little tougher this time. Um, I mean, you're still laughing at a sad little attempt, but you managed to, to pry his bars open. So you two uh, are now now free. We need... Craw? <laughs> Zeus okay. and Magnet. Where um, are we? Figure that out, guys. I okay. can't see the map. Am I supposed to be able to see the map? No. Perfect. I hope I don't have a uh, bearskin rug anywhere near myself. Yeah, where's Frank? Oh, fuck. we gotta I fight totally, Frank. I totally fucking forgot about Frank. Okay, you guys like hear some whimpering. Pretend there's a bear icon in like to your right, Sosa. Pretend there's a bear icon, and you go into like what looks like a storage, and this poor bear is just muzzled and chained up and, and whimpering, and he sees you, and he's like, "Yay!" If if he could talk, he'd be like crying about how they made him dance. All right, we're getting we gotta we unloose him. All right. Um. So there's there's no chains or anything like on the muzzle. It's just like a leather strap. So you manage. You get the poor muzzle out, and he's all happy to see you. And I'm not even gonna make you roll. You just bust his fucking chains. Frank is free. Frank. So where am I? We'll get to you. Okay. That's all I need to know. <laughs> all right. Um. Hulk and uh, Zosa, you guys can. Keep dicking around back there. I'm gonna go back to the combat. Okay. You guys would have heard noises, so you know there's something going on at the other end of the ship. Um. Okay. Uh. So that guy's down. Magda, you're basically done combat. You can't do anything. That guy's stunned, which means it's now Zeus's turn. Oh, you can already I rolled, didn't you? Out of my chain. You can. Okay. That would be another strength check. Uh, you see, like, the, the the rope is starting to fray, but you're not down. Okay. Uh, Zeus, you already rolled in, and you dead. So, only one hits, but you managed to kill one of the guys. So, there's only one guy left, and he's stunned, which means he can't do anything. Um, I think it's your turn. Trying to break the thing. I'll give you advantage since the uh, rope is starting to fray. So you like heave yourself up and use your entire body weight to like break this damn rope, and I'm, it goes like, pressing my legs against the ceiling like. It goes fantastically well, and you end up like snapping the rope and falling, and you've knocked the wind out of yourself. Yeah, I figured that was gonna happen. That's okay. I'm free though. Um, Hulk and, and Anvil are. Crikey. Anvil and Zosa, are you guys 
keep moving north, or are you just going to keep chatting with yourselves? Is this, is this a wall, or to my north? Th those are stairs. Okay. I know this map isn't that great. That's okay. But this is outside, right? No, you're still in the sh un in. Oh, okay. In, in inside. You're still in the hold. Can we tell what direction the combat's coming from? Yeah, you know it's coming from like the other end of the ship, so you're just gonna keep keep going. Um. So Magda, you're stunned on the ground. This guy. Uh, Mrs. Zeus. So Zeus, it's your turn. You're so lucky there's no one else <laughs> on this boat. Like to... You can also punch this guy. That's also kill. an option. I don't want to kill him if I can get to. I just want to knock him out so we can get, get out of here. Um, okay, I guess I'll try punching. Alright, roll me a 1d20. Zeus, I need you to roll me a 1d20. Alright, um, so Angle comes around the corner just in time to see uh, Zeus nail a dwarf across the face, and the guy goes sprawling, just completely knocked out. And you guys are all now reunited, but you, none of you have your gear. And, and Magda's still on the ground like, ouch, that hurt like a bitch. What are you doing? Looking for my gear. Oh. <laughs> um. Roll perception, Anvil. Zeus, help me up. Okay. You notice something that like might hold your gear, but you're not sure. Where? Uh, the shiny chest at the at the very north of the map. Um. The same icon I used in the last time I used it. You get attacked by a mummy lord. We won, didn't we? So I'm good with that. You're also, like, on a boat. Let's open up this chest. I think our gear's in here. Could be a haunted boat. Um, you go Is to open up the chest, and there's there's three locks, because, uh, clearly someone decided your gear was valuable and didn't want any of the sailors to pinch it to sell it off on their own, so you guys need to succeed on three strength checks. We're searching bodies. I'm gonna search bodies. One strength check. So you got one. So you find jack shit. Oh my gosh. Another strength. Okay, so two of them are open. That last lock's giving you all kinds of trouble. Somebody else needs to break this lock open. I can't do it. Meg, did you want to try? Am I on my feet now? Yes, you're you're on your feet. You're you're kind of like oh. Yeah, this is an RP session. RP your way out of this. I help oh. her up and drag her over to the chest. Please open the lock. All right, all right. <laughs> Fucking puts you to shame. <laughs> I just like punch it. There you go. It's done. <laughs> right. So the chest opens, and you guys now have all of your gear back. Yay! All right. Yeah. I can get dressed now. Gear up. I'm sure you guys love seeing me my seeing me my brawn panties. I'm gonna go get dressed now. Okay. Mm. Ugh. Okay. How you feeling, Zeus? You did well Favorite. over there. Hey, I'm feeling pretty good. How about yourself? <clears throat> well, I killed one of the people that I really hate, so I'm doing really well today. No, you don't have a craw. You need a craw. Oh yeah, I thought there was a lack of whining going on. All right, let's go find him. Wow, okay. Hey, I just killed a guy with my thighs. I'm in a good mood right now. These stairs up right here. They're going down. Well, down's where you guys came from, right? 
Yeah, but I thought we looked at the whole place. So you guys, know. like, went up a set of stairs to get into that room. So now you're kind of, like, back in the main area of the hold. Uh, Anvil and Zoza, you guys would have passed some stairs on your way up, so you know where, like, the stairs are. Ah! The stairs. I'll stop oh, moving around right now. Don't forget Frank. Are these boxes of stuff right here, or what is this? Yeah, that's like... Probably uh, supplies, food, rope, all that crap. Okay. I want to go through the boxes and get up I see stairs supplies. down. Okay, um... You bring so, so are you still here? I can't see right here, what's up? Just making sure. So, uh, where do you guys want to go? Also, if you're not in combat, by all means, like, RP your way through it. I don't need to narrate everything. Okay. I'm, looking, I'm looking down here in this lower hold. Anything down there? Went downstairs. I smell you, half-orc! I smell you! Come let me out! Oh, shit, no. I come back upstairs. <laughs> no, come back! Come back! I kind of yeah. look over at a... <laughs> Just I look over at you see not see anything down there, or what? That was fast. No, uh, nothing's down there. Oh, okay. Come back! And there are stairs leading up. Am I standing on the stairs leading up? Yes, you are. Okay. Go okay. Up. Well, I'm done looking through the crates. I got grabbed whatever food and what, like, medical supplies or whatever could have been in there. That are um, to carry around. I'm gonna say you, you like kind of hit the jackpot. And you managed to find a scroll of cure wound. Cool. I don't know what to do with this. Just use it on yourself and get some hit points back. Oh, okay. The rest of us are fully healed, so. Oh, okay. Then I use it. Sure. Like, you it get anyone can just read and. <laughs> yeah, it is. That's the joy of scrolls. Oh, okay. Well, then I use that. All right. You, back. according to this roll, get 14 hit points back. Nice. We get our all our gear back. Yes, yeah, so you got all of your gear back. Um, Anvil and Magjeff decided they want to head up to the next uh, next deck. Zeus, are you still with us? Uh-huh. Okay, so you guys make the decision. You can't find Craw. None of you seem terribly concerned by the fact you're on a boat. You head up to the. Oh, I will be. <laughs> next deck. Which, One. you're not, still not on the frickin' top deck yet. One thing at a time here. <laughs> um, hold on, I gotta talk to YOLO. 6,815 left your channel. Lighting doesn't seem to be working. Some nerd was moved out of your channel. Nope. We're not trying to on that find deck me. yet. I am. I went upstairs. I really wish it would allow you to better center the play zone. I know, it drives me crazy. It's so irritating. <laughs> what are you talking about? Like when you zoom all the way out, it, it's all the way on the left. It's like, are you serious? <laughs> I can't move it over at all? Give me one second. 6,815 joined your channel. Some nerd was moved to your channel. Ha! All right, hold on. I gotta get your icons oh, on the board here. Did I get a full here. rest, etc. Yeah. Um, <laughs> after what I just told you, no, you're not at full hit points. 
Uh, you do probably I have, have slots back or not? Yes. Okay. But you don't have your shit. No! That you is have... unacceptable. <laughs> Fuck's okay, I'm pulling you back into that channel. Six thousand eight hundred and fifteen left your channel. Some nerd was moved out of your channel. Six thousand eight hundred and fifteen joined your channel. Six thousand eight hundred and fifteen left your channel. Six thousand eight hundred and fifteen joined your channel. Some nerd okay, has moved to your channel. Now look at her icons onto the board. What's going on? I have to do um, dynamic lighting, so give me two seconds. Oh. So, Zeus, you should be able to see yourself. I did it. Um, Hulk, I'll get you on the board, and then you can do Frank. Yep, I see myself. <clears throat> Okay, uh, we're all accounted for. I believe so, yes. Okay, uh, Thak, can you see yourself? Uh, yeah, hold on, I gotta zoom it in a bit. Okay. It's a me! Kra! They it's can't see you, they don't know where you are. Okay. Alright, so you guys, you're still not on top deck. But it doesn't look like you're in the frickin' hole anymore. Was this the nice part of the ship? It's nicer. Ah. Obvi, because I'm here. They don't know that, shut it. Okay. <laughs> Still nobody around? We could go we could go Zeus style and start yelling. <laughs> so, hey, hey, while you're right. So you guys actually hear grumbling at one point? Where? God damn it, what the hell are they Where? doing downstairs? Um, it's coming from uh seven o'clock. Where the hell are those guys? God damn it. Fucking what the fuck? That's a bear. <laughs> and you come upon this poor dwarf that's all like, he's going to go investigate the racket that was coming from downstairs. And suddenly bear. And because suddenly bear, Frank can attack first. Bless that fucking bear. I swear to God. Best party member. <laughs> right. Two claws and a bite. On that door. Okay, so one claw hits. Dwarves are young. And the bite hits. You guys have your gear back, so I can put these guys back up to where they're supposed to be. Alright, so this guy's like, because he wasn't expecting bear, he's now prone on the ground with this bear on top of him. Are we rolling initiative now? Towards yeah. the skull. Okay. Or the base of the skull, like neck. Am I involved? Oh, no. Really? Fuck no, you're not. Okay, <laughs> just chilling. You're you are chilling. I really want to bash his skull in. He's laying on the ground. Under a bear. You're, you're gonna. Yeah. I need to stop talking and let you guys play this game.
Wow, these are some shit rolls. The highest roll is Zosa. I don't know what's going on. Uh, so, Zosa, go ahead. It's not Zosa, that's Zeus. Um, I'll... I, I don't know, is he just... He's, He's crawling just... under a bear. You could kick him in the head. Is he a threat? <laughs> he had weapons on him. It, but is he, like, actively attacking us? Or is he He's just like, what the trying hell? trying to punch a bear in the head that's attacking him. You, okay. I know you were, you were too far away to see his initial reaction. Nice try. I'll... You were, like, up here. No, yeah, I know. So I would move and... I don't kick him in the face. <laughs> um, Alright, roll strength check. So is it coming in with the curb stomp? Yeah, bust his teeth out. That's just a martial arts, isn't it? He's a villain. You're kicking him. Farting on are you doing a special martial arts kick, or are you just going to draw kick his head? No, it's just martial arts is kicking and punching. Okay, so do a martial arts thing. I was going to say, if you wanted to draw kick his head, that'd be a strength check. Oh. <laughs> Right, so or whatever. A super like curb stomp on this guy and like bounce his head off the fucking ground. Um yeah, no, he's still awake, man. Helmets, they're this is why you wear a helmet. Whose initiative is it? We need to find out where the hell we are, too. Um, it's Frank's turn. Another bite. Can Frank attack multiple times, or just the once? He can do claw claw bite. Okay, um, so that hits for 7 damage. But if he's holding him down with his other paws, he's just basically biting him. Oh, yeah, okay. Um... Zeus, it is your turn. Okay. Um... Keep in mind that Frank is on top of this guy. Um, I see. What can I do? Um, I like to use the broad sword, I guess. All right, go ahead. Roll. Can I punch this guy, then? Yes, that would be a strength check. But are we trying to kill him or just knock him out? That is up for you to decide. I don't want to kill nobody if I don't have to. So... It's kind All of... Right. Like my con conflict, too, is like, what are we doing? Who is this guy? Cause yeah. I, I didn't see your... conflict, so it should be whether or not you pet that kitty. <laughs> she is. Okay, okay till we establish who this guy is, just, just, just um... <laughs> That's just, um, save. Is it my uh, turn yet? Check. No, it's still Zeus's. Okay, I'm gonna punch him. Yeah. That's what we do. Um, okay, so I need you to roll a strength check. Um, that helmet he's wearing is heavy duty, man. This is good old door forging, so you don't really do much to him, and he's still struggling with rank on top of him. It is his turn. He... What happened to my turn? You're after this guy. You rolled absolute shit on your initiative. Oh, I did. I see. Zozo, Frank. Zo where's Zeus on the board? I don't even see Zeus on the you. board. He got 12.1. Um, so, no, this guy doesn't get much of a turn because he's still struggling with Frank. So now it's your turn. I don't see Zeus either. Two short swords to the skull. He's right here on the left. On the turn order. He's not on the turn order. Oh, turn okay. Order. Oh, he's yeah. on my turn order. Oh, okay. I hit him 21 and a 25. I got him for 12. He, yeah. He's hurting, but he's not down yet. Magda, what would you like to do? I'm taking my hammer to his face. So you right. go. Now you get the idea. All right, roll. Yeah. 
his head went splat. Yeah, I don't like these people. I'm gonna absolute splat. Like his, there's nothing left of his skull. It's just a pink mass, like a that, melon. That's that's a good call right there. They so that was a hundred XP for all of you. That's that's how the, that's how it works. I have. I really hate these people, so I have no problems killing every single one of them. Yeah, me either. You roll initiative, Zozo. Again. Uh, I rolled Zeus's just to put him on the board. Oh. But I don't know what number June had it for him. Uh, is this 12. guy... 12.1. Yeah, 12.1. Did this guy die? Um, uh, pink yeah, his smear. head exploded. God damn it. Excellent. Alright, now let's keep Monk, looking for the these people, Where the hell are we? These people uh. on this boat are the ones that murdered my family. I'm not going to show oh, okay. any mercy to any of them. See, I didn't know that, and I didn't see the combat. I mean, I, the last thing I saw was Zeus murder one of the guys. Right, so and I'm that's like, why I'm uh, letting everyone know what the situation is. Where the hell are we? I'm moving this way. We're on a boat. <laughs> are you all coming this way? I, I mean, I have no Wait, question. What, what to... the hell? Holy shit, it's a half-orc. Kill it. Oh, there's guys here. <laughs> there's more guys? All right, let's go kill them. Right. Uh, it's like right. the one time that Anvil and I are going to see eye to eye on this. <laughs> oh, you're rolling plus ones, right? What? Hulk. What? You're rolling a plus one against these guys? Why? Because favorite enemy? Are they dwarves? Yeah, yeah. these are all dwarves. Everyone oh, here's a dwarf one. that I don't I like. Plus one for everything. Is it plus one or plus two? I don't remember. Is it plus one damage or plus one to your attack roll? I think it's plus one to everything. Huh. I'd have to double check, though. Just a friendly reminder. I don't say. On no, wisdom. It's not saying. Choose a type of favorite enemy, human or dwarves. You have advantage on wisdom, survival checks to track your favorite enemies. Oh, okay, so you just roll advantage instead. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it looks like you know more about them, not necessarily that you kill them faster. Yeah, can't, I don't kill them faster, yeah. So I get wis I get better wisdom checks and survival. Okay, Frank's OP. Yes. Go, Frank. He is a bear. Roll the 20, so he goes first. And he's fighting dwarves. He's basically fighting snacks. <laughs> it's like a boat full of chicken nuggets to Frank. <laughs> it is! <laughs> It's like, oh, hey, there's another chicken nugget. <laughs> nice. Um, unfortunately, only one claw hits. Seven damage. So that's the 19 misses. Does the bite hit? No, only one of the claws hit. Um, because those are advantage rolls. You don't get advantage on these guys. You don't have any way of rolling anything other than advantage with him. Which, which they, is which is fine. So, on. which means I'm going with the numbers on the left always. Okay. Um. So no, only only one hits. Because yeah, I don't have any idea. I, there's I don't have the little buttons at the top of the sheet that say no. No, that, that's fine. Don't don't worry about it. It's it's not a big deal. It's just if you do see that, just know I'm always going with the numbers on the left. You don't need to worry about it. Magda, go ahead. All right. You're back in the basement. Did they fix the leak? No, I'm just not under the lake. Uh. uh, that does not hit, but you get to attack twice. You get oh, two yeah. attacks. Oops. Oof. <laughs> oh no. 
Um, so you're you're so in a fury with these guys. Um, you swing your hammer and you miss them the first time, and you just you, that pisses you off irrationally. You swing your hammer again, and you swing you swing down, and you end up like losing, like throwing your weight off. So you end up like spinning around, and falling to the ground. Great. Oh, whew. <laughs> I thought about her clipping your your shoulder, but it wasn't. I was in the line of fire there. Zach, thanks. I can't get your shoulder. You're too high. <laughs> Clipping him in yeah. the kneecap. The knee there you go. The and that's how Anvil tore his ACL. Arrow to the. I mean, uh. <laughs> that's why Anvil has a weapon. Watching you, so <laughs> Used to be an adventurer like you and took, I took a dwarf hammer to the knee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't have band powers on this channel. Um, so that guy doesn't do anything useful. Um, Anvil, it's your turn. Uh, two swords. The one Frank's attacking right there. Alright. Because I figure the dwarf can handle her in this. Clearly not. Oh shit, I, I'm not on the board anymore. That's better. Takes Beats the shit out of your rolls last week. Zeus? Let me hear. What's up? You're, you're very far away. We're just going to assume he moved up with you guys. So I'm gonna... Yeah. My turn? Yeah, it's your turn. Uh, looking at the situation. Okay. Uh, no hugs. I'm seeing who I can hit without hurting people. You can move. A strangle is just a violent hug, okay? Violence. That's what I keep saying. I let it do broadsword attack. Um, take this. Uh, wait, we still don't know who this guy is, right? Um. Uh, okay. So you. you missed Magda explaining to the party that these are the ma people who killed her family. Oh, I heard that. But okay. Out of custom, out of out of uh, loyalty to my friend, I guess we have to fight them. And they're attacking us. So that's pretty much the attack does first. So that makes they have to go down. I mean, there's yeah. two barrage sword attacks. Okay. I'm yeah, that's what the happens. They attack us first. Yeah. Yeah, that's what they Wait, wait what? Okay. Well, anyway, they're attacking us now, so we might as well finish. Uh, barrage sword attack, two attacks with that. All right, roll. Uh, so you're, uh,. Your first attack, unfortunately, clips Frank. Your next attack, however, manages to hit the bear. Or hit the dwarf. 10 damage. Okay. Um, so yeah, no, your first attack clips Frank. So the poor bear now has a, a cut on his uh, one of his forearms. However, you manage to get your, your sea legs back a little bit there, and you take off the head of the dwarf Frank was attacking. How much damage did Frank do? Frank it. He, uh, 2 HP? Alright. On your pants, it's okay. I gotta keep track of it on the character sheet over here. Uh, oh yeah. Um, so Frank, unfortunately, is, is kind of like, wait, what the fuck just happened? So... Dragon just hit me. Yeah, basically, so we're gonna skip Frank's turn. Oh, we're gonna claw claw bite the, bite the dragon. That's typically what, how Frank handles bad, bad time. In my turn card again, I heal him back up. So he skipped Frank, so who's after It's Frank? a Zozo's turn. It's a Zozo. Go ahead. Oh, you should attack from where you were. That would have been way better. Right through the door. Over her head. Well, I was going to bull rush it. Is there like a window on that wall over there? <laughs> I wanted to throw him out in the water, but somebody moved in my way. To the door. Stupid chrome. 
Okay, um, you do a significant amount of damage to the store. He's, he's stunned. He doesn't know what the hell just happened. Disconnected. Connected. Yes, because that was just embarrassing. Yep. And you swing your hammer again and make contact with the back of this guy's head. And just Crack. scramble his brains. And you send him flying forward into Zoza. And Zoza falls backwards with this dead dwarf upon his body. Okay, we're out of combat RP. That's fun. I go and I pull the dwarf dead body off of Zoza. It's kind yeah, of roughly you're... not showing it really any respect. You're having fun with this, aren't you? Yes, I am. These are the people I've wanted to get a hold of for 15 years. He stares up or down? Well, I'm going to enjoy every moment of this. I, I, I understand and respect that, but we're still stuck on a boat. We have no idea Wait, who we are. Wait, who is that? What the There's fuck? Holy shit! Ugh, God damn it. <laughs> um, roll anvil. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm getting at, though, right, Beck? That we're on a boat, and without anyone to help pilot the boat, we'd be stranded? More or less. It's yeah. Just, it's just a concern that I have until, uh... Doesn't mean I care. <laughs> Uh, uh, that's fine. Or me. I don't care. All right. Um, I'm a ranger, I'm fine. I hate boats as it is, so that's not helping me right now. Can you guys wonder why uh, your, your movement? The dwarf just put an axe into Frank for fifteen, or sorry, for nine damage. Y'all, if you don't avenge this fucking bear. Uh, Anvil, it's your turn. Stick a sword through his chest. Ten damage. Next turn. Uh, it is now Frank's turn. Okay, so only one hits. So the rest of you come come running back and look what the fuck, there's another dwarf. Um could be hard to hit him, though, because Frank and I are in the doorway. I'm not yeah, going to try uh, to. I'm behind you guys. Uh, Zoza and uh, Zeus, you guys can roll initiative. If you can get the cat butt out of your way, Zoza. We can roll what now? Roll initiative to fight. All I see is Zoza with, with cat butt in his face. Um, so it's this guy's turn again, so Frank's right in front of him, so he's gonna attack Frank again. I'm gonna pretend Frank has AC and not missed, because he, he rolled a four. Um, so that's your turn. Well, everybody's in my way, and I wouldn't be able to scoot by, so. Okay. I'll hold my action. Zeus? I will... I'll move close. I don't see any enemies. That's because Anvil's blocking them and you can't reach them. Hmm. Can I shoot through them with lightning breath? Yes. yes. I could, but I wouldn't do nothing like that. I'll try to buy it and build. I'm here by my partner in crime, Magnum. All right. Uh, Anvil. Okay, so only one of your swords hits. 
But you did a lot of damage. That guy's he's really hurting. Uh, go for Frank. Jesus Christ. Okay, Frank is just having none of it. He just got stabbed yeah. by the dragon who he thought was his friend. And then is going to take it out on the dwarf that also tried to hit him with an axe. So Frank fucking lunges forward at this guy and he's screaming and Frank manages to like get his neck and just rips it out. And this guy's like bleeding on the floor. Alright. Nice. Uh, what the hell's going on out here? I don't know. It was Joe whacking off again. Off, Jesus right? Christ, she escaped. That was close. Two guys hey, coming. Guys. Magna, it's your turn. Remember me? Can I use my action? Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> we'll just keep the initiative you guys I'm have. Roll oh, I guess I'm next anyway, aren't I? Hold on, let me get these guys on the board. Who's rolling intimidation? Magna, is that <laughs> Magda is rolling intimidation. Because we know how that's going to work oh, out. That's... <laughs> <laughs> the big boss, too. <laughs> <laughs> Every fucking time! You're such a so, badass. I'm gonna get you, and these guys are like, Fuck, she's just a girl, get her! <laughs> Not that big of a deal. Um, and the one actually, because he gets to go first, charges forward, because you're just a girl. <laughs> <laughs> and fucking rolled a two. <laughs> I uh, know. So those girly charms, I distracting. I shit! <laughs> Um, Zoza, it's your turn. Alright, give me two seconds here. Actually, if you want to just click on the damage for me. Uh, wait. Minus one of those, sorry. Because I moved. Um, Is that right? Okay, I'll just give it to you so I'll not include the 11, because I would have missed. Okay. My turn. Yes, it is. Awesome. So you can attack the guy who's attacking Magda, who's hurt, right, or right. attack the other guy. Um, I would like to. Uh, you know, there's two breaths of attacks. All right, roll. Uh, oh, cranky. Okay, so... You swing over Magda's head because she's so tiny, so... You try to swing over Magda's head because she's so tiny, um, but the dwarfs are also tiny, so you miss the one guy. And then the second swing, unfortunately, you lodge it into the beam of wood right next to you, so you're gonna have to spend your next turn, like, trying to wrench your broadsword out of the- out of the beam of wood. Okay, dokie. Okay. Uh, handle. Oh, I will move, I guess. There, and attack twice. Uh -oh. One facing Magna. Okay. That, that... Dwarven, Dwarven craftsmanship means that your one sword just bounces off that guy's helmet, but you manage to... To swing true on your second sword. And he, he's in pain right now. Like, you just dug it right into him, but he, he's still standing. The guy next to you, like, sees you attacking his buddy and starts panicking, and he just swings his axe at you. And then, uh, what's your AC? My AC is 16. Okay, so he does do damage. He he kind of goes in, like, in the thigh, where, like, you don't really have the best armor, because he's also at that height. And, um, hits you for nine damage. Damn it. It is Frank's turn. Hulk? Yes? It's Frank's turn. Okay. Uh, so Frank goes lumbering around because he just saw his best bud get attacked. 
And oh no, unfortunately one of them doesn't hit. Shit. But he manages to put this fucker who attacked you prone on the ground. Uh, so this poor bastard who, who's bleeding out is so distracted by his blood loss and like being attacked by a half orc, he can't do anything. So it's, it's your turn. Mm. Yeah, same. Yeah. Probably overkill, but he's in my way, so I kind of can't get around. I guess I could probably step over him. <laughs> um. So you're getting fed up with this dwarf armor, especially these helmets seem to be OP. So you actually like grab the helmet and wrench it back, and then do your because you just want to take the helmet out of out of the way, and um, you knock him stone fucking cold. And he's got a post of nose, and he's down on the ground and done. Uh, Zeus, it's your turn. Oh, no, you managed to yank your sword out of the wood, and that's your turn, unfortunately. And okay. both your turn. Okay. All right. Um, you just, like, take this fucker's head off, like, clean off, and just, like, I'm cleaving down, and no more, no more neck for that dwarf. He is done. Where's your Earl at, by the way? Oh, key. <laughs> yeah. Anvil, did you tell everyone? Where is Earl? I no, I was I curious, out of character, that's all. Okay. No, I didn't tell everyone. Looking for Craw. This is a big boat. Yeah, no kidding. I didn't take dwarves for sailors. I know, right? We're usually not. That's that's why I was talking to Thek. I'm like, uh, I really hope somebody knows that. <laughs> Drive a boat or something. Uh, how hard can it be? I thought you said we heard no noise south. I did not say that. That was from the dwarf that you encountered. There are windows on these decks, right? Yes, there are portables. Okay. Um, basically, the discoloration. Can you see it, Zozo? Oh, oh, yeah, I do. Those would be your windows. Where are you bags at? I'm wandering around the ship. Same, I'm sneaking. I have a bear on a Okay, wheel, um, so I'm not for sorry, I, I was distracted. Zoza, can you roll me a perception? You hear voices from the other side of the wall. Hang on, Anvil. Okay. I'm also looking at um, the stairs. I'm sneaking my way around. Okay, uh... Are these that was, and, and you recognize what you suspect might be Craw's voice. Okay. I'll, Those are stairs, Magda. Do you really want to go upstairs by yourself? I'll motion to Anvil. No. Quietly. Stealth. Like, get down there in this room. I don't know where anyone else went. <laughs> you know they went um, kind of north of you in that direction. Just peeking around the corner. The door was closed. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, I should mention door was closed. Um, you did get a really high stealth roll, so I will say you're able to like slowly inch that door open quietly and no one notices. Okay. 
Um, so, so you peer in through the crack in the door and you see a brightly lit, uh, much nicer looking room than kind of the rest of the ship. This kind of looks like an area you think the captain might potentially hang out in. And there's food. And a few, like, um, barrels of wine. And uh, you, you recognize, you hear conversation and you recognize some, uh, a voice as Craw. Craw does not sound happy right oh. now. I'll be passing this information on to the others, but okay. you know, keep it quiet. Um. So. So. Yeah. Cry. You can. You can now join us. All right. Look. Can you just send some of this down to them? I don't care about the others, but just make sure the half orc and the bear get something to eat. <laughs> that ain't gonna happen. Fuck the half orc. He can go rot. You should that enjoy it soon. Wait, it, can is Craw tied up? You can't Am see. I? I told you. I don't remember that detail. Uh, can um, I try to? Okay, yeah, yeah. Wait. I'm just kind of like struggling a little in my bonds, just more for show than anything else. Talking shit, getting it. Well, look, if you're just going to make me sit here, at least hand me some of that wine. Sorry, um, I, two I'm, seconds. I'm, gonna, I'm not jumping in yet. I'm just continuing to listen. Sorry, guys, two seconds <laughs> here. She's not, okay. He's not being beat up like somebody else. Uh, roll perception for me, Zilza. Do you know the one? Can't roll a freaking strength check, but you have amazing perception. Um, I could see through walls. <laughs> right, because of the, uh, the the really good lighting. Um, as some doors are kind of circling around, Craw Craw turns his head, and you can see the bruising on his lip. Like he, someone took a, a gauntleted fist to him. Hmm. I'll motion to uh, Anvil. You know, I'll you know, Anvil Craw is in there. Um, I'll if you want to go full blown and destroy everything, I'll pop up with the doors and kind of give him first go at him. All right, I'm ready. Uh, I'll kick wait, open the doors. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. <clears throat> wait. Yes. Why should you get first crack? These are the people who killed my family. I want first crack. Crawl you can have there. the rest. Crawl is in there. So? <laughs> I'm gonna kick open, open the, door. the doors. Just open the door. We'll take care of it. Magna and I will finish this place off. No, don't even worry about it. Door open now? Yeah. I'm going in. Is someone gonna fucking Spartan kick the door? Or we just... Yeah, that's what I did. <laughs> okay, so you Spartan kick the door in, and all these doors swing around, and oh, Craw... You guys are fuck now. <laughs> one man in heavy duty armor comes around, and he's like, What do we have here? Oh, that's Magnus. You knocked that one out. I'll take the rest, Magnus. <laughs> <laughs> Look! Your buddies have come to rescue you. We don't need to fight. We're all friends here. In fact, we owe your buddy here quite a bit, don't we, Craw? This again? Seriously? You're still trying to play us against each other? They're not that stupid. Maybe I should show them the letter you sent us, bud. <laughs> but the boss has it. That makes me curious, that's for sure. Do, I did Why not don't know. You, do I yes, know um, uh, you recognize him right away, uh, Thek? Well, His name is Gladder Later Pebble Coat, and he is the right-hand man of the leader of the Goldfest clan. Then I'm not gonna let him speak very long. I'm gonna take my hammer to his face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, fuck it. Just roll fucking initiative. You don't guys don't want info from them. Fine. I like this cipher. <laughs> roll ah. fucking initiative. Oh, never mind. 
Frankie, I thought you guys wanted RP heavy storytelling. We do. That it well, yes, until that RP heavy storytelling involved the people I want to kill. So now it's the killing part of my role my role play. <laughs> we'll leave one of them alive. Maybe Why? Hope. Oh yeah, that works out great for us, leaving one alive. No, so that we can get the story out of them. We all on the board. Hey, how Another much experience on those last guys, by the way? Are they 100 each? Yes. So, it's 300? Yes. So we have 30, 30,742, is that what we have? No. no. I'll calculate it later. Okay. Okay, all right, good. Uh, we have... I'm keeping track. All of us, but we're missing three dwarves. All right, hold on. That's what I've got. Oh, yeah. Well, I don't have that much. How'd you get that? I've been adding it as we've gone along. Why? Because James is not keeping end. track of it. He added it at the end. I'm keeping track. Okay. You don't level up to the end. I don't care if you add it now. Wait, he mentioned a captain? The, the captain has a note? Yes, I did. He did. Hmm, interesting. Okay, so he sees you coming at him, Magda. Unfortunately, he gets to go... F no, he doesn't. Yes, he does. I can't round. So he's going first. He, he sidesteps out of the way. And I need to pull the right thing up here. There we go. I did not pull up the right thing. Here it is. He is going to use a multi-attack against you with his great axe, so he's attacking twice. Uh, Magda, what's your AC? 15. So one attack does hit, and it hits you for 15 slashing damage. And I'm going to use my reaction and parry his attack. Uh... All right, you yeah, it's it's coming down. This thing's gonna fucking hit, but you're you're on the ball, and you just use your hammer to swing that thing away. Um, so you don't take any damage then. Uh, it is your turn, Magda. All right. Sorry, two seconds. Mhm. Mm Yeah, you you fucking nail this guy twice. He is surprised. It's like, what's what's going on? Why does why does this bitch hate me? I don't get it. She's a cute little girl dwarf. She's not be able, supposed to be able to hit me this hard. But he is wearing heavy duty armor, so you unfortunately don't do much damage to him. Does the queenly forge mean anything to you? Well, he knows who you are. Okay. He acts like he doesn't. <laughs> no, he knows exactly who you are. Uh, so that's your turn. Uh, I'm gonna skip my turn because I'm kind of in question of what he said. They still have to die, so. One uh, I I know, I but, you know, realistically, I'd be like, like, hmm, interesting what he would say that he said that. I'll move though. All right. Uh, move back. You're not going to, like, untie me or anything? I was thinking about that. <laughs> Too bad, that's the end of your turn. Yeah, yeah I'm um, looking at you like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> I'm giving you this look like... This What'd you not do? Be... Yeah, this... what did you do? Everyone's so suspicious, jeez. So, <laughs> you don't... he's going to move up to you, Zelda. You don't do justice to yourself, though. 
Why I don't know why the fuck I'm rolling. He's not gonna hit you. He, he, yeah. Uh, Frank's turn. So two hit. Uh, and then that dwarf is now busy with a bear. It is his turn. I'm gonna make him roll advantage because he's or disadvantage because he's got a fucking bear clamped onto his arm. Who who turned it? Uh, it's one of the dwarfs' turn. Um, unfortunately, he does manage to get a hit in on uh, on Frank, so Frank just got nine damage. Uh, it is now your turn, Zeus. My turn? Yeah. Frank's gonna have to move out of the way, because he's hurting. Hey, I'm looking at the monster, he is... I'm gonna move first, and then I'm... Frank ever get healed? No. I would like to use one of my turns to heal... One of my attacks to heal Frank. Okay, um... And then I like to use the other one, broad sword attack. Can I do that? Yep. I'm gonna say you moved there. Um. Uh, cure wound. As I'm guessing, what you're gonna use? That's the plan. All right. Can you roll cure wound for me? I don't remember what it does. You say we're what now? Uh, cure wound. Can you click on it for me? I don't remember what it does. Okay, so Frank got seven hit points back. That was me that did that, by the way, not so Zeus. Oh, fuck it. I was just Do you just to... want to take that, Zeus? Okay, then I can attack with one breastwood attack? Yeah. So Frank got seven hit points. Um, Hulk will just take your roll. Okay. So you hit him, and this guy's he's he's hurting, he's struggling. Um, another guy like sees this like pale fucker go running past him and decides to go and attack him. And I'm not gonna bother rolling because he's not gonna hit you. So it was so so. Uh, whose turn is it? And well, it's your turn. Uh, yeah, again, you take this fucker's head right off. You're not aiming for the helmet anymore, you know that's not gonna work, so you have to kind of almost go down on one knee to, to take these guys' heads off, but you do it, and his head goes flying, and that's how the game of football was invented. Alright. Put one dwarf down. One dwarf down. It is Cross' turn, what would you like to do? Well, since none of y'all care to untie me, I'm gonna cast Misty Step. Alright, uh, you, you managed to teleport to there. Alright, um, does that affect your bonds as well? Nope, I just poof out of them. So you're not in them anymore? Nope, I turn in, well, yeah, I turn into mist and move 30, up to 30 feet away. Okay, that's all I wanted to know. So your hands are now free, so you can attack yeah, the next yeah. turn. So I can Eldritch Blast next time! Alright, this guy is very focused on... Magna. Magda, um... Where am I gonna keep do them, this? Keep them focused on Magda, because that's better for Anvil. This guy is actually gonna use his turn to cast Battle Cry, which means each creature uh, within 30 feet of him that can hear it, is not already affected, gains advantage on attack rolls until the start of this guy's next turn. Uh, this guy can then make one attack as a bonus action. So sorry, Magda, you're not out of the fire yet. Okay. Uh, and he does hit you for 15 damage. And I'm going to parry his attack again. All right. He's getting frustrated because, damn, lady, your your royal training is... is... <laughs> he can't hit you. He, he should hit you, but he's pissed. <laughs> um, Magda, it's your turn. 
that parry kind of threw you off a little bit, so your your first swing goes wild, but you manage to, like, nail him in the kneecap and, like, the next swing. Nice. So that's your turn. Um, I will... Two hits to the guy on my left, one hit to the guy on my right. Right. So the guy's turn, ah, fuck it, I'll roll anyway. Swing and a miss. Alright, Frank. That guy right there. Alright. Frank uh, knocks this guy prone, and he's screaming bloody murder. You suspect Frank has hit an artery, but he's still alive. I mean, it's raining blood, but he's still alive. Uh, Zeus, it's your turn. Okie dokie. Uh... Okay, let's try to finish this off this time. And two broad swords to the face. Great roll. So one hits, and um, yeah, you your sword goes right through his face and out the other side of his head. Nice. All she wrote for that guy. Anvil, it is your turn. Uh, you also have a pillar, take note, um, in between you and the one dwarf. Oh, yeah. There. Okay. So now I can still hit him. I'm going for the dwarf, not the full metal Not jacket. it, okay. So, um, you swing both your swords, and he, unfortunately, like, sees you coming around the corner, and he ducks out of the way, and one of your swords gets lodged in the wooden beam. Oh, no. So, next turn... You get one sword? You get one sword, and then you can do a, a strength check to yank your other sword out of the wood. All right. Uh, whose turn is it? Uh, Craw. Eldritch Blast at this guy close to me. Alright, roll. Uh, he... Turns to absolute fucking ash. Haha, <laughs> get fucked. So we have one man left standing. He's very focused on, on Magda. Uh, He's gonna do a, another multi-attack on you, Magda. Okay. And he fucking sucks, so it's your turn. Yeah, you, you, your hammer bounces off his, his armor, and he's kind of like, that hurt, but fuck you. Zoza. Sorry. Is 
Is it my turn? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um... How is Thek doing? Oh, uh, fucking amazing. Okay. Uh, I'll hold my action and let her murder this guy. <laughs> All right. Uh, grumpy bear. Um. He's going to move there and nothing and no okay. action. Uh, Zeus, it's your turn. Uh, I can't use lightning breath. Uh, wait, who's in the, who's in front of me? In front of the enemy. Silza. Okay, so that's automatic lightning blast, and it goes anyway. Okay, I would like to do two broadsword attacks to the monster guy. All right, roll. Yeah, he he's noticed a massive dragon now coming down upon him. And oh, and yeah. you do some damage to him. Uh anvil. I'm in range. Indubitably. I will s smack him with my sword while I try to fix pull the other one out of the thing. It's it's pretty in there. It it <laughs> kind of moves a little bit, but that sword's still stuck in that beam. That sucks. Craw. Ultra blast out of space. Right, so this guy unfortunately has noticed this massive freaking dragon. He's like, oh shit. And he's now turned his attention to Zeus. So he, one of his attacks does hit you because he used a multi attack. Ah, uh, where does she go? He hit you for 15 damage, Zeus. And Magda, it's your turn. Okay. So you see this guy attacking your, your, your buddy and you're not fucking happy about it. Nip. Nail him for 24 damage. Ha! Uh, Zoza. Uh, I'm still... Oh, Alright, um... Yeah. <laughs> just gonna stand there, huh? Is Frank I, still hey, just gonna chill? It's your fight. I'm letting you do your thing. Uh, is Frank's turn, Anvil? It's Frank's turn, I. Yeah. If you start struggling... I'm gonna have Frank wait in the back since this guy's full of metal. Um, Alright. So so Frank kind of gets the hint that he's he's hurting, so he goes and hangs out with with his with his buddy who helped him in the city, convinced everyone he was a circus bear. Yeah. Uh, Zeus, it's your turn. Zeus. What's hello? I your turn. You. Roger. It's your turn. All right, let's see. Let's do what we did last time. Go right in this guy's face. All right. Two broadswords to the face. You clicked the wrong thing. thing. Sorry. Can, can I redo? Yes. Yes, redo. Renew. Sorry about that. So one attack hits him. Uh, it's Anvil's turn now? Mm. 
I'm gonna stab him with a sword. I'll have to wait to get the other sword out until after combat. Oh, you can do that every turn if you want, to try and yank it out. Okay. That wasn't one turn thing. Still loose. It's, it's coming. It's getting there, but it's still in that wood. Uh, craw. Your your sword is stuck in this pillar next to us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> With my badass strength, I buried it in there. Uh, Rise and chop the. Unfortunately, Kra, only one of your attacks hits. He, he's he's figuring out your your thing apparently. Unacceptable. It's his turn, and he's still really distracted by this dragon. In fact, um, correct me if I'm wrong, swapping weapons counts as an action, correct? Yep. Alright, he is going to take his turn to swap to a spear. Unless you drop the weapon, it's a half action, right? No, he's complete. I'm going to just take it as a full action, so he's swapping out to a spear to deal with this dragon. And that will be his turn. Magda, it's you. So is that you're going to skip your turn? Nope. Oh, okay. There you go, Anvil. Um, so you're trying not to point out the irony about the fact that Anvil laughed at you earlier when you tried to get out of the cage? And I'm just like, oh hey, I'm not a scrawny little monk, you, you loser, and you yank out his sword. And the Anvil just kind of stares at you like, I fucking hate you, as you hand it to him, and he takes it from you. It's just going to be embedded in the metal of this guy's back. All the quicker to make that... Uh, never mind. Whatever. Um, Frank has noped out. Uh, so, Zeus, it's your turn. Zeus? My turn again? Yeah. I'm sorry, I got my niece and nephews in here, so... Yeah. Um... All right, let's finish this guy. Uh, two more broadswords to the to the face. Okay. So unfortunately, one of them does anything. Okay, okay. He's starting to huff a puff a bit, but this guy, he is he's a fighter. He he earned his spot commanding these dwarfs, and he's he's still got a lot of fight left in him. He probably also has at least 300 HP. Mm. You should know me by now. Anvil, it's your turn. So you have both swords back. He handed it to me. Craw. Eldritch Blast. There we go. I didn't even know you knew that spell. Eldritch Blast. I never heard you use it before. Right? right? It's a new one. It's a new one? Yeah, brand new. Seems pretty powerful. It's it's pretty decent. Okay, so this guy's got his javelin or his spear out now, and he he jabs at you, Zeus, and unfortunately hits you, and you take thirteen damage. Jesus! So in his first rodeo. That would have killed the bear. Uh, Magda. I really want to pound this guy's face in. You're working on it. Yay! Good god, 28? I mean, he felt that when he's staggering. You've put some serious dents into that armor, so it's probably not doing much for him right now. Awesome. Uh, so is a...
I can't do anything anyway. I'll just... <laughs> Stupid Chrome is freaking out again. Stupid girl? Is it Chrome? Oh, Chrome every... Chrome. every once in a while it'll oh. freeze the whole... Roll 20. It's probably just... It's probably Roll 20 freezing. It is Roll 20. Um, Firefox does that too sometimes. Um, so... We'll just say you're gonna let Magda have her fun. Uh, Zeus, it's your turn. Is your, um... Is your robot messing with your computer? Are they staying up late or something? <laughs> <Don't>. <laughs> Zeus. Turn again. Yes. Okay. Two bow broad to attacks. Okay. Okay, now nah, those are good. Now nah, that's awesome. This guy's finally starting to to, to bleed. Anvil. Starting to bleed. I've been putting swords in his back for an hour. He's in some heavy duty armor. Need his dwarven armor. It's only no, neither hit. Shit. So, yeah, he ducks. I mean, he doesn't have to duck far, but he ducks. Craw? Yeah, he only, he only saw one coming. That is this guy's turn again. He's getting really pissed with you, Magda, so he swings around with his spear. And fucking rolled a nat 20 on you. Uh, I should still be able to parry it, though, shouldn't I? Uh, that, no. Oh. Not a nat 20. Okay. Um, so you can't parry that one, which means... You take 17 damage there, lady. Okay. Uh, it's your turn. Takes it with a smile on her face, because she knows Hell what's yeah. happening. So you use kind of his spear's leverage and take another swing at him and manage to, like, nail him on the side of the head. He's dazed a bit. Uh, Zoza. We're just gonna skip those two. Uh, Zeus. 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 Your turn. Zeus. I was thinking of the Hercules movie about that. Okay, so only one of his attacks hits. Ugh. Anvil. Yeah, stupid midget ain't ducking this time. I think they prefer dwarf. You learn to swing low. I don't think you care. Craw. Sweet cherry. <laughs> so this guy's barely on his feet by this point. He's hurting. But he's gonna take another stab at you, Magda. So he would hit. Guessing you're just gonna parry it. Yep. Alright. Hitting me with melee attacks. Alright, roll. Can you like parry every melee attack? I thought it was. Just... No, I can do a total of four. That was my third one. I was gonna say otherwise you're just like the monk. No, I'm expending something called superiority die. Zeus. Turn again. Roger. Yes. Okay. Um, let's change it up this time. Two uh, two lightning burst attacks. Alright. Motherfucker. <laughs> I'm buying to be some bitch. You're not in the way, that's why I used it. Uh yeah, neither hit. I don't know how, because you're at point-blank range, but neither of those hit. 
Wow, that's you aimed attack. too high. <laughs> Roger, right over the dwarf. He just kind of fizzled there. All right, Ansel. <laughs> You sneezed oh. in the middle of your attack. <laughs> so that fucking right. sword's back in that that beam. God <laughs> damn her! <laughs> now that's my sword number two. It was sword number one last time. <laughs> Great. I'm just gonna let go of it and let Zosa pull it out. <laughs> I'll, I'll keep All right, Craw. Bring us home. Fuck this guy. He fucking went splat. He's dead. Ha ha ha! Eat shit. <laughs> Thanks. Time to go through his pockets. Yeah, now I need to get my sword out of the damn wall. Wall strength check. Yeah, time to go through his pockets. Yeah, I got my sword out. Are you just going to stare at me the whole time, Zoza, or are you actually going to do anything? Uh, I'm going to keep an eye on you. Well, I'm also well can you keep an eye on me while also guy. helping us not die? You guys are fine. Whatever. That guy was 1,100 XP. Yay! Mm -hmm. you have anything good in his pockets? Um... A very nice looking gem. Uh... Oh, nice. so, uh something uh, Magda would recognize as like a family crest to go in a beard. Oh, you guys smell a fight. I don't know, the uh, the pebble coats are not terribly influential people. Um, I take it anyway as a trophy. Pebble coats. <laughs> I know. Uh, really. And that's about it. I mean, this guy was in full gear. And okay. not a well, lot else on him. The, everyone else is armed and shit, I'm assuming. So, yeah. did they find my stuff? Hey, did you guys find my stuff? I don't know, did we? Damn. Oh. Okay. You had stuff? Yeah, sure, I have stuff. You know how okay. I usually have a bag with me that's got like a book in it? And how I don't also have that right now? That's that's the bag that has the relics in it. If you don't have your book, can't you not cast magic? Some spells. Yeah, let's go yeah, find I'll... it. Elvis yeah, probably got it. is not one of the ones she can't cast. Clearly, I was just confused about that. I wasn't sure if she couldn't cast any magic or how that worked. Bye, Zosa. So I like ran off to go find my shit. That's awesome. <laughs> this is like relics for her. <laughs> right. Can I sense where they're at? They're nearby. Thanks. You just don't have them. Is this Maggie, you just upstairs? went through a wall. Oh, Mac just I? got skills. Yes. Let's go this way then. Here we go. All right. So you're stealth, but you're leaving the rest of the party behind. Mm, I'm waiting for him. Hey there, Eager Beaver. You don't see me. Okay. Are they on the ship? So, like, nearby? do you guys know how we even got or here? On the floor nearby? Not a nope. clue. Wonderful. I'm guessing that uh, since this is a dwarven ship, the dwarf should know how to pilot it. I don't like boats. How hard can it be? You turn the wheel, you have a sail, sail into the wind, whatever. We'll figure it out. Last I remember was killing a bunch of people before. Yeah, killing things, that's what I do. Yeah, that's what I remember doing last time. And then I don't know what happened. Killed a bunch of people, took a nap, and ended up on a boat. Yes, that's I mean, a, I've had stranger weekends, but... That's yeah. about the gist this of what is, I remember. This is up there. Oh, I'm gonna go up the stairs. Wait, you're all here. Zeus. Oh, that's what I'm looking for, is upstairs. Okay, um... Ten minute bio break. Okay. Yay, I gotta conduct a mission.
Do a little of you there. Yeah, what up? Craw. What was he? Yeah, what up? <laughs> what was he talking about? Hmm? I have no idea. I don't know. They saw the signet ring in my pocket and assumed I was some sort of noble and started going on about a letter and I have no idea what's going on. Which what signet ring? What the one that Magda had. I pulled it off her body. Interesting. Yeah, apparently it's an important noble human house. I don't know. Are we all back? I am back. The resounding silence is no. Nope. This is quiet even when he's here, so... Yeah, I don't hear Thacker yell well. Uh, yeah, my... dealing with my nieces and nephews.
240 gig solid state drive for 75 bucks. Thanks, son. Is that good, Zoza, or not? I wouldn't say it's great, but it's decent. It's a sand disk as well, so it's not a terrible RAM. Uh, uh, what's the speed on it? Is it just a regular SATA drive? It's SDSSDA. So is this just on what we call it's a Is that key back? Mm. Yeah, that's about average. There's a hundred and thirty nine dollars for a five hundred gig Samsung SATA three. How much? Hundred and thirty nine dollars. That's about average too. Between a hundred and thirty to hundred and fifty dollars for a five hundred gig is about average. Uh, hundred and sixty. I think I spent hundred and forty on my SATA. And it's 500 gig. There's an 8 terabyte hard uh, regular drive for 250. I try not to go anything over 3 terabytes. Just because I'm not sure about how stable it would be storing that much data. I don't want to lose that much data if I get a failed drive. That's my big thing. Yeah. I have two two gig terabyte two terabyte drives in my um, in my dock right now. This is what I want right here. Let me get it right quick. They're so good to fill. What's that? It's ten it's times memory? faster. No, it's an SSD, but it's ten times faster than your standard SATA SSD. It just looks like a memory chip. How do you plug it in? Uh, motherboards have special slots for them. Oh. It's an M.2 slot. You might have a slot for at least one. They're very, they're pretty common in the last two years. Oh. Like blinking your shits up. So, your regular SATA drive, the one that you posted. Yeah. Its speed is... Read-write speed is 530 megs. Well, let's just round to 500 up and down. Read-write. Yeah. This one is 3,500 megs up and down. Oof. Uh, round to 3,000. 3, so, at a zero... <laughs> Yeah. It's craziness. Or almost out of zero. Yeah. Yeah, it's like Star Wars. You'd you'd launch it and it would just be up in like three seconds. Characters loaded and everything.
Okay, so the speed difference would be your current SATA speed divided by three and a half. So, for example, if it takes 10 seconds to load Star Wars, it would instead take just over two and a half seconds to load Star Wars. That's pretty good. I was assuming you have Star Wars loaded on your SSD. Yes. I am back. I'm back. Thank you. All right. So you guys head up those stairs. Now find yourselves on the main deck. Boom. Put your tokens on. My tokens are on. Anybody else going to put their tokens on? There's a Zoom the token. Zeus, put your token on the board. It's not letting me. What the shit? Sorry. There we are. So you guys are now outside. And in case you weren't sure you were on a ship, you now know for a fact you're on the ship. And you can see the ocean all around you. Oh boy. Um, to the right of you, you do notice coast. Thank God. <laughs> About to be our ship, though. So what are we gonna do with the ship? Just kind of steer it towards the shore and figure it out from there. I mean, uh, just let. Unfortunately, it you guys are in broad daylight, and as you come up the stairs, um, fuck these guys. You hear a very, very loud, uh, laugh from not the upper deck, but in fact, behind you or to the south of you, and some dude in heavy duty armor looks over the railing. Now you can see what I see. If you scroll to the bottom, some dude in heavy duty armor looks over the railing. Oh shit, that a fancy man. And, um. Wait, what happened? Oh. We're nothing. looking at this fancy man. Because he's way the fuck up on. Got it. Yeah. What, the little green guy? Yeah. Okay. And so, everyone who's up on top deck sees you. Um, I'm changing to my bolt for now. And, um, this guy just starts laughing, and he says, You know, I should have expected it. You've been such a pain in the ass to find almost 20 years now. Shouldn't be surprised you're breaking out of the damn cells. Damn right. Uh, uh, Bagda, you would recognize this guy as Halgrim Goldfest. King number one on your two murder list. The, the the leader of the Gold Goldfist clan. Guess what? We're all gonna murder that guy. Right, let's get to and murder. I point at him. I really apologize guys. I had to take pot because my back's killing me and it's like hitting me. Um That's fair. So dun, dun, he, he kinda dun, he dun, laughs dun. at you, um I have such great plans for this, and it's not going well. You're not going anywhere. Taking you to the capital city, we're handing you over, and then I am done with you. Boys, go bring him back in. Some like guys there, some other dudes from another the deck. Same dudes at us that we've been. We just plowed through two decks of these dudes. Roll they sent more dudes. Roll persuasion. Yeah, come fight us yourself, you big coward. It's like, yeah, go ahead and call uh, call the rest of them under the decks, because they won't hear you. Um, he he stops and has a head and hesitates, and he, he notices for the first time that you guys are all, like, covered in blood. He's like, um... Do 
dwarf brains are uh, brains are dripping Sock. off my uh, <laughs> hammer. <laughs> But you, you see him kind of hesitate, and some of his, his boys kind of swing around looking at him like, uh, what are we going to do? Should we do this thing? Can I just... So tell you what, why don't you and Magda duel? That way you can settle the thing honorably. We don't have to kill any more of your guys. We don't have to deal with the big long battle. Pilot. Magda, does that sound good to you? I agree with that. He leans over the edge and screams at you. I'm not doing that. Hell no. Point is not to kill her. I need to deliver her dumbass alive. Coward. Right? We got ourselves a. Ba -ba -ba -ba. You couldn't ba -ba -ba. kill me when I was 25. You're not gonna be able to kill me now, asshole. You stupid, dense stone head. The point wasn't to kill you. We were supposed to take you alive, you dumbass. That was the deal struck. That's why we haven't killed you yet. <laughs> Who are yeah, you making deals sure. with, anyway? Fuck you. Reroll yeah, if you want that answer. Get out of here and say that. <laughs> Reroll if you want that answer. That's a, a pretty deep question. Yeah, proud of him. Fuck. I'm Croft. This is literally all I'm good at. And he, he's rolling <laughs> like shit. Um. Fuck you, you stupid human. The deal- uh, I can't talk. The deal was always with the human minister. He's done his part moving up, and we've done our part. And now that we're gonna deliver Magda, our deal is done, and we can rule the mountain dwarfs. This human minister, he wouldn't happen to have horns, would he? It's the finance minister, you dumbass. Haha, <laughs> I thought so. Okay, question answered. Now we can get to killing him. Alright then. Since you don't agree to our duel, we'll just have to murder everybody. <laughs> can I, uh, grab... Yeah, not. Can I grab the guy standing in front of me and throw him off the edge? Strength check. It doesn't actually kill him, though. I mean... Or, unless he's in heavy It's a dwarf so, in heavy armor. I'm, I'm kind of trying to make a point. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is a dwarf in heavy can... armor, so roll again. You've got disadvantage here. Oh. Do I roll disadvantage? Just roll again. Okay, um, he, you, you try to lift him up, but you're not used to, to carrying this much weight. You, you don't, you don't lift, bro. <laughs> and this dwarf struggles, and you manage to, like, slowly, slowly, eventually, and, like, you have to bend down and, like, push him over, and, like, the smooth, like, make a point thing you're trying to do is not even remotely graceful. <laughs> Yeah, he only weighs like 200 pounds. But this guy did eventually go over the edge. Good job, Zosa. I'm guessing that starts combat, so I'm gonna Eldritch Blast the guy next to me. Yeah, roll <laughs> initiative. Initiative. That is not something I'm good at, by the way, guys. Initiative. Noticed. Hold on, the initiative board. No oh, fuck. Oh darn! Shit, you guys are gonna have to redo it. No, we're still in there. Yeah, That's three wrong. times. Oh. Yay! Yes! Finally did it correctly. You just needed a reset, that's all you needed. Um... <laughs> what, are you pacifist all of a sudden? No, that's the bear. Okay. Oh, okay. This poor bear is still hurting. Um... Like, I don't want to fight. So, Zosa, you somehow get another turn out of this. So you hooked the guy over the edge. Scared the other guy, kind of. Mm, wait, is this guy a new guy? Um. No. Oh, okay. Sorry. I thought you moved him over, but. It's your turn. Yeah, I'm thinking. That's gonna burn up your turn pretty fast, Smokey. Okay, I want to bull rush that guy <laughs> right here. Are you gonna push oh, him yeah. down the stairs? <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, strength check. Disadvantage because he's on heavy armor. 
Can I use Step of the Wind to enhance that? It's strength, so does Step of the Wind give you strength? It gives me a bonus to dash. So that's Are running. You dashing? Uh, would it I, would it dash? Dashing is, no. is is speed. That's not gonna help your lack of lifting. Oops. Oh no, that's right. Fucking hell. Um, this poor guy does not see you coming, and you like, he fucking goes rolling down the stairs. It's Anvil's turn. My computer just said virus, virus, and it's giving me a bunch of alerts. That's not a move. Uh, is the guy prone down the stairs? Yes, he fell down the stairs like head first. Okay. Right. He went down the stairs. Yep. Get the next guy. There's still a guy standing there. He's standing right next to Craw. Please fill him with arrows. Thought shot three, but... Um... Good. Only one hit me, yay! Craw, you just took 11 damage. Ow, fuck! Anvil! Uh, okay, um, the guy who fell down the stairs is actually just getting up. Um, that'll be the end of his turn. Meg, it's your turn. I don't think I'm close to anybody, so I'm gonna go find somebody to kill. Hi! It's only one hit. Doesn't matter, one's all you need. Crush his face in. So by Mr. Dwarf. Oh, it's your turn. Um, you also notice a couple of guys, like, like one guy come, like, bursting through a door. Behind you. Where behind me? Um, south of you. Yeah, that's the guy I'm shooting at. Okay. Sorry, I should have specified which stairs. Uh, Frank. Hulk? Yeah. Spare's turn. He's moving. Okay. Uh, it's your turn. Miner's hoses. Uh, those sorry. Um, gonna taunt the. Yeah, I'm just gonna move up, but I'm gonna taunt the guy on the balcony. Why don't you get down right, here he's... and and fight it yourself? And fight yourself. Don't send your lackeys at us. And I'm gonna throw a roll intimidation dart at that guy. <laughs> I'm gonna roll intimidation. Hmm. Oh, sweet. Um, yeah, he saw you bull rush that door, and now he's like, ah, I don't know about these guys. 
and your dart hit that guy's armor and, like, did no damage. Uh, Alright, Anvil. What? I was gonna ask if I can make another attack. No. Okay. Anvil. Three arrows. Alrighty. Only guy I can see. Uh, so one does not hit. Uh, but you do down the poor guy who, like, came out that door. Uh, the poor dude who got bull rushed comes sprinting back up the stairs and sees you, Anvil. You have to be the closest, and he's going to take a swing at you. Oh. And it's going to do absolutely nothing. Wait, Spartan what's your AC? Down the stairs. 16. Okay, yeah, no, he it does nothing. Um, Magda. I don't see anyone. There's a dude north of you. Oh, okay. So you take a swing at this guy, and you, know, you you hit him hard. He's dazed. Nice. Some other poor fucker just comes running out that door. It's the end of his turn. He's nowhere near anyone. Pra. Eldritch Blast at that motherfucker. There's two motherfuckers. The dwarf motherfucker? South. That one, that I'm pinging. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's hurting. He's, he's still going. Uh, I'm guessing Frank is gonna sit this one out. Hulk. Move him there. Okay. Right in front of Eldritch Blast? Eldritch Blast? I would never hurt Frank. Oh, there. Just saying. Okay. We have this line of sight problem. <laughs> Any attack? That was 25 feet. I think he moved. Yes. I would, I would strike any one of you before I hit Frank. I'm aware. Yeah, Frank rips that guy's throat out. Yeah, Frank! You're my favorite person in the world. Even though you're a bear. Um. So, so. Uh. I mean, there's nobody else except for the guy up top. Can, is he, he's visible. Like, I can throw darts at him. If you want. Uh, I'll throw a few darts at him then. Mm-hmm. Kind of still taunting him, being like... She's down here. Go... Uh, what is it called? Like an honor fight? Duel? Yeah. A, Blood duel! An honor duel or whatever. Whatever, this guy's Winner clearly not all. honorable. He's not listening to you because he's got darts coming in his face. Um, one actually pings his armor, but it doesn't do anything. The other one doesn't hit. Anvil. You gonna Spartan kick this guy down the stairs again? You wanna Spartan kick this guy down the stairs? Frank check? Yep. Yes! <laughs> so this poor bastard goes flying down the stairs. Um, he has to use his turn to stand up. Meg, it's your <laughs> turn. Your well, he's down the stairs, so there's not a whole lot I can do right now. Uh, Craw? Any of those guys upstairs got bows? No. I cast fly on myself and move 30 feet up. 
All right, two seconds. Where are they located, by the way? Like right here? That sucks for you. I hope if I clicked on the right thing. Um... I need you to place your token kind of where you were, but like you're in the air now. You're not even with these bricks. Like there, I think. Yep. So that's where you are. <laughs> Main deck. Oh, fuck. Yep, on a boat. There we go. Boat, boat, boat. Really, really big uh, boat, apparently. Fuck. like four decks kind of right. boat. There's nobody to eat. Okay. Um door open right there. Zoza. Can I go in there? Uh okay, so okay. For, from, from what I could see he was Was that where he was? I wanna throw my grappling hook at him. Shit, he's too far away. Yeah, Grappling hook. They're like that one. Um, that one balcony's in the way. You can't get them. You uh, could do grappling hook on Carl's pants. Nobody wants to see that. As funny as it would be to like moon this entire dwarven delegation <laughs> from midair. <laughs> So he's on the upper deck. If I wanted to get to him, I would have to either grapple my way up there or take the stairs in. Yeah. I'll take the stairs. I can move. Okay, there's two sets of stairs that you see that would head up. No, you only see one, and it's um, north of you. North? What about these stairs right here? These are going into a room. There's... Yeah, those would be the stairs you have to take. So the stairs to the south? Yeah, but those are in a room, so you, you don't see them. Uh, okay. Oh, no, shit, I'm stupid, I'm sorry. Um, No, those stairs you do see do take you up. Oh, Directly because south. Right here. Yeah, sorry, I'm fucking stupid, yeah. But is this, like, a ledge, or is this... How would I... Okay, so you see those stairs? Yeah. Do you see where they take you? Up onto the, the back balcony. Okay. Yeah. Alright, interesting. Uh... Is there anything, like, like, where does this pillar thing go? Um, that would be the mast. Or a mast, it's got okay. sails attached to it. Oh, I should have made fucking craw roll decks to avoid sails and rigging. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, I'll... She's make Peter my... panning it right now. <laughs> I'll make my way into Hell the building. Yeah. Um, but I'm only gonna move, so is that... Since yeah, you're still time. technically in combat, courtesy of the idiots who Spartan kicked a dwarf down the stairs instead of just killing him. You can take uh, your dash action, fun. though. And move double. Actually, I could step of the wind onto the next level, where he is, I think. That's not the next level, though. That's the third level. Uh, okay, but my... Let me read it. Dash, disengage, double. I don't know. My end game goal is to kick him into the middle of the arena, pretty much. Or get him down um, there where, where Magda is. Step of the Wind looks like it's only going to get you up once the next deck, not the one where he is. 
Okay, I'll do that. All right, so you are up on the next balcony. Uh, I'll get to you in a second. I'm taking you off this initiative board. <laughs> um, and Volt's your turn. I'm going for the stairs itself. I wanted to rain hellfire on my enemies. Okay. Um, this dude has just come running back up the stairs. What do you guys want to do? Kick his no, ass back down the stairs. He comes, he comes running back up the stairs, sees Magda, and he's going to take a swing. Oh, shit, he rolled a 19. Uh, that is 9 damage, Magda. Okay. It's your turn. What do you want to do? I guess I could have killed him, Magna. I'm sorry. But I thought taking him down the stairs was way more fun. Uh, congrats, you just broke your toe and did a damage to him. He's still standing. Who? Magda rolled a 1, so she just hammered her foot. Oh. I have 23 hit points left. Oh. Tragic. You're gonna die. You're gonna yeah, probably. die. So sad. Zeus, are you here? Zeus. Fuck it, Zeus rolls a fucking Brossler attack. So I'm not, I'm not dicking around here. Zeus kicks him down the stairs again. Brain right. damage, the guy's dead. <laughs> Alright, um, that dude's dead. You guys are now out of combat. So you can move cool. freely. Um, Zoza, you don't count, you're on a different level. Can I cast my shit yet? Where are you? I'm floating up in front of the dickheads. I'm about to drop hell on them. Fuck's sake, fine, fucking... I need like three different initiative boards right now. And can I get Zeus I mean, to heal I me? Think each... I think each map is on the board, you? doesn't it? No. No, it does not. Um... He would heal you to the detriment of his own life. You know what, if you're off the map, I'll get to you guys in a minute. Okay. Is the, uh, the stairs that I'm going for these ones down south? Yeah, those are the correct. You're headed in the right direction. Right. I'll just say Frank's with you. Yeah, he is. He's right in front of me. He was in front of me. He was inside a, a building. Right, I asked you if the door was open. He said yes. Sorry, that's... Those are the stairs taking you up to the next balcony. Oh. So, yeah, no, I'm just gonna say he's right beside you. So he's oh. not charging up by himself. Um, I'm guessing the rest of you guys are just going upstairs? Yep, yep. once I can get Zeus to heal me. Uh, okay, I will cast Cure Wound. Uh, for six points. Good, she's, you're good to go now. You have over almost 30. That's plenty. Almost she, 30. Good to go. She's get. got lay on hands, too. Okay, we are done with that map. Uh, Zoza, you would be kind of right where you can see the uh, steering wheel. Can you see it? Yeah. Um, the rest of you can put your tokens on and start rolling initiative. More guys in heavy armor. Yep. Um, Zoza. We are actually going to take a turn where it's just the bad guys on Zoza. You would have had one round at least before the rest of them come up. So, yeah, one of them it looks like would have had an attack first. And that guy missed you. Uh, so, Zos, it's your turn. Oh, 
Hmm. You know what I'm thinking? <laughs> You're rolling disadvantage because there's two of them. Okay. <laughs> He's rough joined your channel. Uh, strike. Ah. Uh. <laughs> so you're on a fucking roll right now, and you just pinned like two dwarfs in heavy armor and sent them flying into the ocean. Christ's sake. Um, he did that thing he, like, this backwards and propelled them with his feet and just like catapulted them off the ship. He did a fucking Dragon Ball Z shit. I don't even know. <laughs> He's gonna move because he didn't see the rest of you coming up. Um, all right, now we're doing actual turn order. So, Anvil, it is your turn. These guys are silver. Heavy armor? No, they're just dudes in heavy armor. Alright, right, I'm not sick enough right. banshee on you. Okay, roll. I could do this all day. It's so only two hit. One kind of bounces off the guy's plate. Mag, does your turn. Well, that dude I was going to throw off the boat move, so I guess I got to move too. All right, you broke your toe. Right. Um, <laughs> then right here, yes. <laughs> so the one guy is still going to go after Zilza. Three in the ocean, one down a set of stairs. It's too far away. This is amazing. So it's his turn. This other guy is going to see you guys and like, oh shit. Go to Magda, he's going to take a swing. Fuck, you rolled a nat 20. And what was your AC, Magda? 15. Ugh, he hit you twice. Um, so the first attack would do 12 damage, and the other one did 9. Alright, so that's your turn. That leaves me with 8 HP. Cool. What you get for charging ahead? Yeah, he should stay in the back, but that's all right. We'll kill this guy and get him. Okay. I could totally do that, right? Fifty-five feet. Not unless you spend a fuck ton of key there, bud. And you'd have to roll dexterity on top of the save because the uh, wheel the wheel's is in, in the way. your way. Oh, okay. I mean, if you want to go full fucking matrix. Screw it. Cranky. Okay. <laughs> so you you do your thing. Uh, do the dex roll first. Fucking hell. Uh, strength. He's in heavy duty play, so you're rolling disadvantage. Just roll again. Fuck. Uh, he sees you coming, and he just fucking like. Stops like he doesn't even move. You do nothing to him, and as a result, you think you might have like fucked your soul shoulder, not the one you got bit on, the other shoulder. Like that thing's like you suspect you might have just fucking dislocated it. So good luck with that. Um, so this guy just saw the smoke charging at him, stopped him, so now he's gonna take a swing at you. 
Oh no, shit, that's the wrong guy. I feel like he's already attacked Magda. Oh, uh, you went flying away from this guy, so now he has to go back. I was on a roll, okay? <laughs> and he's within range, so he's gonna attack. And... Missed. And where Magda breaks a toe with her hammer, this guy just lodged an axe in his foot. <laughs> oh, he doesn't have toes. It's very dangerous being a dwarf. So, yeah. Uh, Frank. What's happening with Frank? See. He's gonna maul that guy. Okay. Zeus. Zeus. I don't know where he went. I'm just playing for him. It's so only the one claw does anything worthwhile. Uh, I'm going to take, we're going to do Zeus's turn next, because I forgot to put him on the board, and he is going to cast, where to go, uh, Sanctuary on Magda. So you've got that going for you now, Magda. You're a protected deer. I gotta read this. <laughs> Oh shit, that's a bonus action. I can do something else. Still have lay on hands. Um, Zeus is also going to cast aid. So the three he can he's gonna cast this on is Magda, Zosa, and Frank. No, Zosa, you're fine. So he's gonna cast this on Anvil, Magda, and Frank. So you three get plus five hit points. Okay. And then it, it will be Anvil's turn. Whose turn is it then? Mine? Yep. You get, why are we getting plus five? Uh, Zeus cast aid. Aid? Oh, okay. Two plus five to everything? All right, uh, you should have some time, so go do what you gotta do. Uh, Mag, that's your turn. I'm gonna hang back. Okay. Did you want to move back as well? Yeah, okay. Yeah, moving back with Zeus. Uh, so this guy's gonna take a swing. I believe I have 63 hit points right now. 63? Yeah, I've only been hit twice. Yeah, well I started this with 35 HP. Uh, yeah. Zeus, it's your turn. Not Zeus, sorry, uh, Zozo. Zozo's in between two metal knuckleheads. Okay, I'll stop trying to be creative. We're not going to throw that one off the ship, too? Oh, yeah, you've got a dislocated shoulder. 
Oh, that's not good for you. You only get one attack now because one arm's useless. So I'd get. Or you can try and strength trek that giant back in. But if you crit fail, you might rip your arm off. That'd be awesome. <laughs> Let's do that. Or just make it worse. Uh. Yeah, I did it. That hurt like a fucking bitch and did absolutely nothing. Yeah. You're in too I'm much pain, you can't really do it yourself. That was your action. Okay. Uh, Zeus, um. He's gonna move up. So the guy's turn. Uh, and he doesn't do anything. It is now Frank's turn. Hulk. Yes? It's Frank's turn. He's going to claw this guy to death. Okay. Okay, well, it's gonna give you the crit damage anyway, because fuck it. Oh, the bite does not hit. Bite doesn't hit? No. It's 11. Oh, it's your now your turn, Anvil. Oh. Sorry, Zosa. Of course, Zeus is right in front of me, so... Yeah, um... Zeus just took 18 damage. Yeah. Who are you talking about? Uh, no, I they didn't. 18 to 14 and I got a crit fail. Um, Zeus actually doesn't take any damage because both of those are below his AC, so he, he knows you hit him, but they didn't do any damage. He bounced off his armor. The other one, however, um, just because of where you're standing, uh... Frank just took six damage. What? No. You just fucking shot your bear in the ass. That thing went wild. Did go wild. It was a crit fail. You shot your bear in the ass. It was a shit throw. A shit shot, I know. The next ship you see on that ocean horizon is gonna be the Sea Shepherd as Greenpeace is gonna like shove your swords down me. your throat. Greenpeace. Horrible person. That's, well, that's whale watchers. Sea Whatever. Shepherd. He's a splintered off of Greenpeace. He's more the Sea Shepherd is more what do you call it, uh more Anyway, it's Magda's turn. I'm still holding back. Alright. Uh, this dude, uh... That's absolutely nothing, so that's your turn. Uh... I want to cast... Shatter on this point right here. I'm not going to try and bull rush this guy down the stairs. I thought about that, but, you know, broken shoulder and everything. It'd be perfect. <laughs> All right. Um... But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move and then cast Shatter. Okay. And it's... Yeah. I'm just going to move a little bit. Uh, Shatter will be right here. And it's 10 feet. I'll post it just a second. Oh, oops. DC, what are you... Hold on. Let me make sh make it... Where the... F Is this supposed to be a DC 10? That's 3d8. 3d8 damage, or the DC... There you go. Oh. Um, it's a... 
Yeah, but it's not showing what I have to be. Like, according to this, I have to be to zero. Yeah, I don't have it set up properly. I don't know what it is, though. It's supposed to be... What's your constitution? I think, it's, I think it's supposed to be my wisdom. It's saying constitution. That it's their constitution safe, but it's my it uses my wisdom as my casting. Okay, so what? Okay, so it should be um in your fucking spell section at the top. What number do I have to be? Sixteen. Okay. Sixty. Sixteen. Oh. Uh, no, they both failed their rolls. So, they took 10 damage each. 3d8. 12 was my first roll. Um, so, uh, 3d8 thunder damage. Which it rolled as a 10. That's cool. Oh, no, sh Yeah, a one, a six, and a three is what you rolled for that time. Yeah, that adds up to ten. See, I did the math. But my original roll was twelve. Fine. Let's kill him already. A non-magical object that isn't being worn or carried also takes damage? That sucks for them. All their armor. Uh, it's Zeus's turn. And they're wearing metal armor. Oh, Jesus. Oh, those broadswords just rip ass. Good God. Who's going to cast what? Horde something or other? Uh, it is Frank's turn. I don't even see YOLO on the board here. Because she's not on the map. She's busy doing other shit. She said she was going to cast something. Yeah, except I don't want to have, like, initiative stuff mixed in with other initiative stuff that's happening, so we're going to get to her. Oh, okay. She's not helping you guys at all in this fight anyway. So that guy is still somehow up. And, well, it's your turn. Congratulations, you just did 19 damage to, to Zeus. Why to Zeus? Because he's right in front of you. Why did you move right in front of me? He's been there for two turns. That's uh, not a good place for him. <laughs> you, like, I, can't, I can't move. Yes, I move you can. Right. I can move left or right, I'm still... You can move diagonal. Area. Like the worst team player ever. <laughs> I'm not the one who walks right in front of the guy throwing arrows downrange. Everything's always someone else's fault. It's Zeus's fault this time, or otherwise known as you. He's Zeus. been two turns. Where are you I at? Two turns. You have shot him twice. Gave him warning shots. He's the only one doing damage to this warning guy. Warning shot. Gave him warning shots last time. He didn't move. So. I was playing Zeus. Zeus' this character, I've turned around and, like, hucked you over the side by now. Okay, um... You do remember that Ricky. I'm stronger than him. Egg, are you sitting out? Yeah. 
Okay. Uh, Silza. Yeah. This guy just rolled two crits. You just took um, 24 damage. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Oh, uh, so it's Zeus's turn. He's pretty fuck you right at this point, and uh... Oh, look, he moved out of the way. Could have done that two turns ago. So that guy's dead. Which guy? The one that I was shooting at? Now I gotta shoot through freaking Zeus again. You have room to move. So does Zeus. Like, it's gonna be your turn first, like, we'll leave. <laughs> um, it's Frank's turn. Frank's feeling kind of useless right now. All right, it is your turn. This could go badly for you, though, Zozo. If I mess now. You still got a bum shoulder. Magda, you're just sitting there? Yep. Alright, uh, this guy's gonna swing at Zozo again. Yeah, he, he didn't hit you this time. It's your turn, Zozo. Okay, uh, I'm gonna back up. Okay. And try to fix my shoulder. Uh, that would be a strength check. It hurts like a motherfucking bitch, but you finally get that joint back in. Is it useful now? Yes, it is. Like, it still, like, hurts, it's tender, you probably shouldn't be using that arm, but, uh... We're in combat, so you're going We're to. in combat. It's now Zeus's turn. It's only one of his attacks hits. Uh, Frank. I've done the wrong thing, sorry. Uh, Frank is clawing at this guy's armor, but it, he's, his claws are not going through or really doing anything. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to skip you, Magda. Uh, this nice. guy. Where's those ago? Oh, he effed off. Oh, so this guy is swinging at Zeus. Zeus now has like a third of his hit points. Okay, so it's your turn. Zilza. Um. Thinking, thinking, thinking. No, I'm just gonna throw some darts at that guy. Okay. Oh, fucking Chrome? Or Roll20, whatever. Disconnected.
connected. Connected. So tired of shit. Uh, Frank's turn. He's gonna half off. Okay. Same way as, uh, as well as his character did. Okay. Uh, once you're done with that, it is your turn again. never get all three to line up at the same time. This guy's in a lot of pain now. Uh, Zoz, that's your turn. Alright, one actually manages to do some damage. That is Zeus's turn. And Zeus is the one who finally brings this fucker down. End of combat. Alright, there's gonna have to be some healing done. I'm actually thinking we might end the session there. Yeah, everybody's effed off. Can we just yeah. camp out right here? <laughs> just kidding. Hey, um, What'd you say? It's, we'll just camp out right here. We will deal with uh, fixing hit points at the very start of next session. Alrighty. And uh, Yellow can just stay on that map and we'll get to her next session as well. Uh, I Sounds hope it good. was enjoyable. Trying something new here. Did I screw up your entire thing? No, you didn't actually. Cool. She was ready. Because Molso just wanted to do something different, plus a faster way to get you guys to the capital city. So I was like, hey, boat. Now how do I make this fucking boat interesting? We're gonna murder everyone who knows how to ship, uh, you know, pilot the yeah, boat. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. <laughs> we're gonna kill everyone who knows how to pilot the ship, and we're just gonna crash it into the pier. <laughs> yeah, we are. They're here, bitches! <laughs> Put dwarves on the boat, that makes it interesting. <laughs> What'd you say? Yeah, because dwarves, dwarves on hate the boat. boats, so it's, uh... No, oh, I love dwarves on the boat. That's good. I just don't see how they see anything. They're too short to see over any of the rails. No, dwarves in general don't like boats and being on the water because they're so used to being in the earth. There they are don't like being there on the water. There are maritime dwarves. Are there? Yep. Yes. Huh. Okay. The biggest problem with the dwarves are they're dense and they don't float. <laughs> well, totally Floating is rails. a problem, yes. After Zosa's done with them. I don't, I don't see, I don't see. They're also in heavy armor, those guys are drowning. Dwarf yeah. that doesn't float. Alright, well, I will talk to you guys in a bit, I gotta go do some things. Hope it was good. Hey, thank you, Jim. 6,815 disconnected from your XP? channel. Yeah. What do we get? That's what I have. That's what I've got. Uh, oh, I'm not. I haven't counted the guys that we just recently killed. Thirty-two, eight, forty-two. That's what I have. level, I think. I you said thirty-five last week. What was it? Damn it! I thought you did. <laughs> I thought it was thirty. I'll have to look. Go ahead and look. No whisper target found. 
checking. Thirty-four. We're getting closer. We will get there eventually. Starting at eighth level, I get land stride. Moving through non-magical difficult terrain costs you no extra movement. You can also pass through non-magical plants without being slowed by them and without taking damage if they have thorns, spines, or similar hazards. In addition, you have advantage on saving throws against plants that are magically created and manipulated to impede movement such, such those created by the Entangle spell. Tenth level, I get hide in plain sight. Awesome. So that would have helped against those dryad thingies? Yeah. Whatever they were? And you just walk through trees like nothing. But 10th level, I get uh, hide in plain sight. You can spend one minute creating camouflage for yourself. You must have access to fresh mud, dirt, and plants, soot, and other natural occurring materials with which to create your camouflage. Once you are camouflaged in this way, you can try to hide by pressing yourself up against the solid surface, such as a tree or a wall. Uh, you gain a plus 10 bonus to dexterity stealth checks as long as you remain there without moving or taking action. Good God. And vanish at 14th level. You can use the hide action as a bonus action on your turn. And also you, can, you can't be tracked by non-magical means unless you choose to leave a trail. That's not even a spell. That just is. It's just you being sneaky. Oh, I'll be right back. Cantrips are free to cast, right? I have no idea. Everybody still here? For the moment. Still says Zeus is here, but he hasn't been here for an hour. Well, he did say he was going to have to leave. Remember when you were waiting on Zoza, he was like, oh, I'm going to have to leave in a couple of hours. That was fun. Lots of killing. Yes. Less role playing, lots of killing. Lots of role play killing. I was worried that June had like some big speech plan that she wanted to say. My character just completely interrupted him with a hammer to his face.
I got one of these. A... I just got one of these during the middle of that combat. Microsoft alerts, and it was a robot voice telling me that I got some kind of porn something on this computer and that they're going to report my IP address or something. And I'm like, I've never gone to any suspect websites on this computer ever. So I don't even know what that would be from. Wherever you get know. your downloaded stuff? No, nah, it just has to be. Is I have a don't... website that it's just, up? It's just, it was just a pop-up, and I kept hitting, trying to click it to close, and it wouldn't close. Finally, I just I clicked the Are button. We says, yeah, we, we all died. Are you for reals? <laughs> the ship hit a rock and started sinking. Beautiful. We got we killed the last of the silver armored guys, and then we didn't have Zeus. Everybody was starting to fade, so June called it. Man, I didn't get to drop my AOE on that motherfucker, the smug bastard. Oh, no, nope. <sighs> You're just gonna have to hang in the air for another week. <sighs> <laughs> just sitting there. Hope your spell lasts. Arms that crossed, long. just staring at this guy, like checking my watch. <laughs> right. All right. How's the Amazon warehouse prior to Christmas? <laughs> it's fucking crazy because we we were understaffed to begin with, and now we're getting an increase in volume and maybe some extra people in the future at some undetermined point in time, but probably not. So it's not so. Yeah, this, do you get like Christmas pay bonuses and shit for working at Amazon? Uh, we did for. For Thanksgiving, we got four hours of holiday pay, plus those of us that worked that day got time and a half, which was nice. That is nice. So I'm guessing they'll probably do something similar for Christmas. It is a huge company, and all this guy is trying... Did you see the comment he made? Because somebody said... Uh...